Welcome everybody to Common Hood. We are here finally with 1.0. It's out. Common Hood is finally out. It's exciting stuff. Now this game has been in uh, works for, I believe, years. Years. Yeah, we're talking years. Don't know exactly how many years, but <laughs> I know it's been years that they have been working on this game. Now for those of you that don't know what Common Hood is, what is Common Hood? Common Hood is a community building and economy manage game, management game with highly customizable base building tools. Scavenge for materials, grow your own food, research new, uh, new technology, craft new tools, build a home, make friends from your community, and take it from surviving to thriving. This is developed and published by Plethora, Pleth Plethora, Plethora, Plethora Project. So this is a Plethora Project. Um, before we jump into this, if you are super excited about um, Common Hood or you're picking up Common Hood for yourself, please make sure to smash that like button and, um, and I'll bring you some more Common Hood if that's what y'all want. Now there's a few things here, obviously. Um, play story, play, play sandbox, and multiplayer. Play the story is the main mode of the game where you explore and craft your new home within the abandoned factory. Sandbox is a creative sandbox mode to design new blueprints and structures, which sounds pretty cool. And then multiplayer, a creative multi, which I guess they don't give us a, <laughs> they don't give us a description of multiplayer. Multiplayer, you just play multiplayer, right? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> right. Okay. Well, with that being said, um, let's, I'm going to do the story mode. Obviously, we all want to do the story mode. The main mode of the game, we'll do it. We want to build the community in this abandoned factory but i didn't choose to leave my home but i also didn't choose to start from scratch i always thought that everything was going to be all right and this kind of thing didn't happen to people like me after my dad passed i found no way to pay back the hospital bills nobody seemed to care they were ready to take everything away i needed to find a new start and build something that they could not touch and I didn't want to depend on them anymore. That's where you kind of, we, we understand, right? A little bit. I couldn't leave my home before seeing the place both my parents worked at. This factory fills the memories of my childhood. But it has been abandoned for years now. I found out that I wasn't the only one attracted to the factory, though. I suppose... A proper introduction is necessary. All right. By the way, shout out to you, Zombie, for one year of a membership. That was very, very kind of you to re-up for the one year. So happy one year anniversary. Thank you so much, Zombie. All right. Here we go. How you doing, Ashley Stevenson? How you doing? Good to see you. So already, look at this. Kind of get hit with a lot of stuff, right? Uh, we will go through the tutorial for the most part. We do have a hot bar here. Uh, they want us to talk to Ash, talk to Rhett, talk to Mo to introduce ourselves. But let's go ahead and hit the flashing button. That's right there. <laughs> so welcome to Common Hood. After an eviction, you are forced to start from scratch. You found temporary shelter in the abandoned factory where your parents used to work. Occupy the factory by crafting tools, shelter, and producing economic independence. Bring a community together and resist these challenging circumstances. Basic controls. And it's very simple. Item management. Very simple as well. I do not know if there are controller support. I do not think there is controller support. At least right now. All right. So here we are. This is the factory. Let's go introduce ourselves, say hello. Hi, how are you? This is the factory that we will be working out of for the most part of it, yeah. Hello, Mo. What are you doing here? Did they kick you out as well? Yeah, I didn't uh, know where to go. Many people have passed through this place. Make yourself at home. What's your plan? Plan? Yeah, you don't plan to stay here forever, do you? I don't know. Well, my advice is make yourself useful. I'm more of a farmer myself. Anyways, you might want to talk to Ash. I'm Mo, by the way. 
Yeah, so these different uh, citizens, I guess you could say, are going to have different traits and different skills that you're going to want to use um, for building up your community at first. So all that good stuff. Hello, Rhett. Aren't you too young to be in the streets already? I'm 20. Well, that's quite young. Are you a junkie or something? No! Relax, just asking. How did you end up here anyway? My dad used to work in this place before, before he passed away. What is going on here anyway? Well, I'm sorry to hear about your dad. We are squatting this factory. Isn't that obvious? Squatting? Legally occupying this abandoned property. Legally? Well, it should be, at least. Uh, nobody is using this place and we don't have anywhere to go. I see. Uh, do you mean everyone here is homeless? We don't call ourselves homeless. This is our home. People come and go. We are like family. You are welcome to stay, though. Thanks, I don't have anywhere to go either. We know. You don't have to explain yourself. Welcome to the common. Very well. So that's Rhett, and we need to talk to Ashley, which might be over here. Yeah, over here. Different tents and things like that. There's Ashley. Hello, Ashley. Mm -mm. Ah, mission complete. Introduce yourself. Hooray! Another one who fell through the cracks. Cracks? Wake up, girl. You are here because they don't care about people like us. If you are not making enough money and keeping your mouth shut, you end up in a place like this. Well, that's not my story. My dad passed away and I lost the house. I couldn't pay the hospital bills. Exactly. Get yourself together. Everyone here makes, the, uh, makes themselves useful. I see that you have a tent. Why don't you place that somewhere? You will need a place to sleep. We'll talk about it again later. All right. The common. Where have I heard that word before? Maybe practically anywhere. <laughs> there must be a way to explore this place. I still have memories of when my parents used to bring me here when I was a kid. But it looks so different now. Perhaps I should set up a temporary shelter here and see what I can find. I'll go ahead and unpack some things I brought. I'm sure the table saw will be useful. All right. Wow, look at this. A lot of things going on right above my head. You see all that? A lot of items received. Dollars, water jugs, tents, uh, tutorial, food storage, advanced placement, placing objects, everything. Debris. It all just came in. Okay, so let's, let's go through the tutorial, like I said, right? Placing objects, very simple. Number key, shift, bam, R, rotate, good, got it. Advance, you can rotate by 5 degrees, 90 degrees. Uh, you can pivot, very good, Ross. Food storage, there is a food cellar near, your, near where you started this game. This is where you store the food for your community. Characters will consume the food in the cellar. Make sure you never run out of food or your community will suffer from hunger. Obviously, and up here at the top... You can see we have at least 10, I think, 10 food. Yeah, 10 food. Debris. As you explore, you will run across debris, rubble, and wreckage with blocks, building areas, and paths. You can clear debris by holding left click. Items may emerge from the debris. Uh, once clearing uh, progresses reaches 100, the debris will disappear. Good. All right. So this is all the stuff that we have. Uh, we have a shovel, which we should probably like put that in our hot bar right away. And we have a tent that we should probably put down right away. Water, I think we can store. I'm not going to mess around with that. Dad's books, useful, I think. Gas generator and table saw, also useful. Let's put down the table saw. Dad's books, some books you took from Dad's collection. They cover a wide range of topics. Reading them might teach you various techniques. Let's see if we can do that. Let's see. Okay, Dad's books. Oh. Oh, we can actually, like, put the books down. Yeah. Okay, very well. Table saw. All right. Now, I think in this game, you can only put things like in the uh, pad, like this little like pad here. I think that's what you can do. I don't know. I, I played this long, long time ago, but we'll put the table saw right there. I guess in the meantime, we could like honestly like pick that up. That's some serious table saw. Where did you get that? It's my dad's or was. Uh, it was one of the few things I could get in the truck after the eviction. Do you work with wood? My dad taught me we used to build furniture in our garage. I see. That could be really handy here. Really? How? Uh, could you cut some 4x4s out of some raw lumber? I guess. Uh, what do you need those for? I've been trying to start a farming operation here, but I need some raised beds for farming as this place still has lots of polluted soil. The 4x4s will be per perfect to build planters. 
Okay, sure, I can help with that. Well, great. I need 40 4 by 4s Wow. A lot of 4 by 4s <laughs> 40 of them. Very well. Good to know. Missions, you can access the mission tab from your backpack. Advanced item management, you can uh, control. Boom, boom, boom. Kind of like the quick, uh, quick sort. Power. Machines like the table saw require power to operate. Place down a generator from your inventory to provide power. Uh, when you have more machines, you need to place more power sources accordingly. Each generator, for an example, can power about 10 machines. My lord. Generators, however, consume gasoline and will need to be refilled after several days. If you explore, you can also find solar panels, which provide constant power depending on how much light they receive. They stop working after sunset, which is 6 p.m. Um, and then crafting very much is, is easy to know. Okay, so we have that. I kind of want to like, yeah, pick up a little bit of debris here. Yeah. And does that go straight into my, yeah, raw lumber goes straight into my inventory. Very, very good. Okay, okie dokie, art of freaking jokey. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Maybe a little bit of this. Thank you. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, I, I'll, I'll take all that, please. Put that in there. Thank you. Put that over here. Raw panel and raw lumber. That's a that's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot, a lot. We got that from the stockpile. I see. Okay. Right. So let's go ahead and put down a generator if we're going to want this to work. So let's grab this. Put that there. And then, oh, God. I don't know if it needs to be nearby. Um, I wonder if I could just, like, slide it in somewhere. Like over here, maybe? No? Let's see. Probably not, no? Um, hang on a sec. Let me actually, can I move this stuff over here? Can I move this pallet? This seems very, like, intrusive for that to be sitting there. No? Okay. We'll put the generator, I guess, over here. Right there. There we go. Generator has now been installed. Very good. Okay. And then all you have to do is click on it, and then I think you can add. Yeah, fuel remaining 95 hours. My lord. That's a, that's a hell of a generator, I tell you what. All right. So now we need to place our tent as well, uh, which is kind of questionable because it's like where, like, right? Um, it's kind of like we're in the way. <laughs> I feel like we're in the way with our tent. So I guess we'll just place it like right there. All right, so there we go. We have our tent. Our tent is now here. Good to know. Generator next to the tent. It's probably not the safest thing. All right, let's see. Sleeping. So after 9 p.m., you will get tired. You will need to sleep. Place a tent and sleep on it or in it. If you build a shelter, you might be able to have a nicer night's sleep. So right now, we only have the tent. Build a shelter. Better sleep. Sleep. Uh, shelter quality. The shelter will define the happiness of your community members. Privacy. Don't place beds too close to each other. Well, look at us. Noise level. Don't place beds near machines. Well, definitely look at us. Aesthetics. Use decorations to give characters to, uh, give character to, wait. Use decorations to give character to your shelter. Ah, give character to your shelter. And then you will get a bonus if you match a character with decorations they like. Cool. Alright. Now, with Dan's books, I feel like that's something we should probably put down, too. Um, yeah. Maybe we could put it down, like, somewhere over here. Dad's books. Right there. There we go. I guess this is one thing that we could do for research, right? Research. Uh, you can research new technologies to unlock craftables on machines or grant other bonuses. First, you will need to select which technology to research from uh, the tech tree. This I've done this a lot back in when I played this. Uh, the research is actually kind of cool, I think. Uh, research nodes uh, can sometimes be locked. You got to, you know, missing knowledge and all that. Yeah, we're, we're pretty familiar with a uh, research uh, tree, I'm pretty sure, right? Okay, excuse me. Hello, Ashley, my lord, or Ash. Uh, let me go ahead and make some 4x4s, and I would like to do 40 of these, please and thank you. There you go. Make them by fives. Done. Boom. One thing you got to make sure, make sure you pick that up off the table. <laughs> yes, don't forget about that. Okay, so now that we have those columns in, construction materials. Construction materials like beams can also be placed. And this is where the game really gets, uh, really stands out from other games, uh, is the whole construction uh, dealio. Now, Mr., uh, Mr., was it Rhett that said about the farming, or was it Mo? Oh, it was Mo. Ah, very nice woodworking. Where did you learn that? Let me guess. Your dad again? Yeah, I was always hanging out with him in the garage. We built a treehouse together, actually. It's a nice project to learn. Now I can get started with my farming operations. You want to help me out? 
Absolutely. All right, so here's the blueprint that I've been following. Do you think you can uh, build a planter? It shouldn't be a problem. You will need 4x4s four in soil uh, that you can find scattered around on it. So, building a planter. Again, this is where the game uh, divides itself from other games out there. So blueprints you've made or found in the world are available in the blueprints tab of the backpack. This is where the game can also get kind of hard, too. Um, the whole building. <laughs> you can place a blueprint in the world uh, to get a step-by-step -step guide for completing a blueprint. If you run out of materials in the middle of a building, uh, building a blueprint, you can interact with the machines and, st and storages to get more materials without canceling the blueprint. Uh, once you grow your community, you can request characters to build blueprints for you, which is actually kind of good. Uh, so creating a blueprint, once you've placed several construction materials, you can group them into blueprints, group objects by pressing G. I'll hopefully remember that. And select the place objects to which you regroup, give a name to the blueprint by pressing enter. Yeah, we'll see about that. Okay, so I want to put the farm stuff over here. There is a universal inventory kind of uh, thing thing in this game. Like I believe, I forgot what it is, but something you build where you can store stuff in. Um... That's really cool. Um, and then you can just pull out kind of like uh, how, how do I explain it? Like an inventory system where I put wood and stuff in and then you can use it as building. I think I believe if I remember correctly. Look at that. Look at all that. So am I too tired to actually pick this stuff up? Very well. This is where I'm going to put it, though. I'm going to put all the uh, all the all the planters up against this wall, I think. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so we are officially tired. It is 9.20. Uh, we don't even... We haven't talked to this gentleman. Hello, who are you? You're Alcott? We're too tired? To, okay, very well. <laughs> too tired to talk, all right? Just like, get in. Owner should be me. Assigned to me. This is me. Thank you, my lord. How you doing, everyone in chat? Hope you're all doing well. Community storage. Yeah, community storage. That's a good way to put it. Community storage. Once I start uh, kind of like flushing out this uh, tutorial here, I'll, I'll definitely be able to read what y'all are saying. But right now, we're just kind of like going about it. Okay, so again, I want to put my uh, planter boxes over here. Grab my materials that I've left on the ground. Now, I don't know what warrant the energy. I don't know if it was because it was past a certain time. Where it's like, okay, I'm too tired because it's past 9 p.m. I'm not sure what warrant the energy there. But let's see here. So this is our blueprint. And we want to put, place this down, yeah? So small blueprint. Uh, right there. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, so this is where the game gets a little kind of crazy. Okay, so. It's asking for a 4x4. Four four. I have it. I, I placed it. I placed it. I placed it. I placed it. Okay. I see now. This is way easier than it was back when I first played this game almost a year ago. So far, I can already see the improvements. This was the one thing I was a little nervous for about today. <laughs> but I'm glad they, uh, they fixed it. Because this game was supposed to originally come out in March. And it definitely... Um, how do you say it? it definitely uh it definitely did not they delayed it now i need soil now i wonder if i can like walk away and like find soil real quick without that little you know ui on me soil soil okay perfect we got the soil put the soil in our hot bar there we are there we go okay good 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 do 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 and now we put the soil inside. There we go. Okay. Okay, come on. There we go. Okay. Okay, this this okay, this is this is exactly what I was afraid of here. Okay. And I put soil over there. Okay, wait a sec. Pack, can we pack? Tr try again. 
Back it out. Back it out. Come on. Try again. Okay, put the soil right there, right? Put the soil right there. Put the soil right there. Okay, pack it in. Maybe we go like this. Okay. And we'll put soil right, right, right there. I don't know. Okay, pack it in again. This is the one thing I, that, about the game that I had trouble with a long time ago. Oh, God. Okay, try... Okay. Soil in. Right there. Slide it through. Let's go. <laughs> corner to corner. All right. Okay, let's, let's pack it in. Pack it in. Try again. Okay. Put the soil in the box. Try again. Oh my god. Okay. All right. We've done it. Lord have mercy. Yeah. You have some nice crafting skills. Are you sure? My lord. That doesn't need to be that difficult. Okay. Thanks. I enjoy building things with my hands. It helps me forget how I ended up here. Listen, everyone has their stories like yours. The kind of thing is happening to everyone, actually. Still hurts, though. It sure does, but farming can be really helpful. Uh, I can see that, but uh, so what can I do? Let's start by planting some potato seeds and watering them. Use the planter for your build, or that you, you just built. Here are some seeds. You can always talk to Cedric in the back. He's always collecting seeds and talking uh, the end of the world and stuff. I'm sure he can sell you some. So, like this game, or I guess when you're putting in, like, soil, you can only, like, place down, hold the mouse, drag to the corner. Do that, and you will fill that up. It's not like how this was when you built the uh, planter box where you, like, put one thing, one thing, one thing, one thing, one thing all the way around. The soil is a, like, complete different animal, right? Now, I would like to put more in. See, like, that is, like, one click, one click, one click, one click, one click type thing. I would like to put more planter boxes in so that we can, you know, have multiple crops going here. Let's go ahead and cancel that. Now, if I cancel that, can I resume that? No? Not really. Once you cancel it, it's canceled. So you got to pack it all in here once again until you have the enough, I guess, enough resources to build that blueprint out. You can't like walk away. It seems like you can't walk away too much. Walk away from the blueprint and come back to it later. And it seems like also that I placed down a blueprint, started building on it, and it has damaged, I think damaged my, um, well, I don't know. It cut my four by fours in a weird number here. 13.34 is how many 4x4s I have. So, very interesting. Alright. Let's go ahead and clear this stuff out. I'll make some more planks. We'll do a little bit of that and all that. Hmm. <clears throat> <laughs> We'll go ahead and fix this all up, and then we'll talk to, I guess, well, we can't talk to, I don't see him, unless he's walking around. I think his name's Cedric, right? Cedric. Grab some seeds from him. But we'll clear out all this debris. I saw you digging into that debris, looking for something. Well, I thought we could use the space for farming, even uh, building some structures. Who's going to do all that? Well, I will, I guess. Maybe some people might want to help later. Good luck with that. People don't have much energy or hope around here. Hmm. Look, go ahead and clear all those debris. It can't hurt to have more space here. All right, that's exactly what I was already doing. Don't give me uh, attitude ash. How dare you? How dare you? All right, continue that. I do like the character that we play as. I like the overalls, I like the tool belt. It's kind of cool. There we go. As a child that wore a lot of overalls growing up, I approve. Absolutely approve. All 
All right, let's finish this out. It does say we have zero people in our community because I think we're still trying to like get past the whole tutorial phase. But we're not considered like a community yet. Until I guess I clean up this place. Once I clean up this place, then we're considered a, a community. Now this is interesting. Who are you? Ant farmer? This, this used to be a remarkable place. It once gave uh, jobs to hundreds of people. Now it's just a shelter for wildlife. This sinkhole made the whole factory collapse. The accident killed several people. It was the cause for the factory to go bankrupt 15 years ago. It was all over the news. You probably heard about it. What's with the mask? Is this place toxic or something? No. They belong to the people that used to work here. You should ask the others. Strange. <laughs> no, they, they just, you know. They don't... Nothing toxic here. I just wear it because the people that used to work here used to wear it. So that, you know, that that's very well. <laughs> very well, indeed. She's just missing the Crocs. You, you're, you're right about that. At least she's dressed appropriately, not like in Wildflowers. There you go, exactly. She's dressed a little appropriate, isn't she? She's not running out here in heels. Jeez, that was hard. I see. Uh, you didn't give up easy, huh? Um, I don't have anything else to do. I might as well make something out of it. Mm, maybe I underestimated you. Why are you here anyways? Nostalgia, I guess? My parents used to bring me here when I was a kid. I thought maybe I could find the place where, I, where they used to work. You know where I can find the administration wing? Administration wing? Not really, no. But listen, if you are going to be poking around here, be careful. People end up in this place for all sorts of reasons. Not everyone is friendly. Are there more people here? People come and go. I've seen people on the other side of the sinkhole, actually. I see. Thanks for the advice. Is there anything else I can do to help? Hmm. We've been talking about... Uh, we've been talking on building a planner machine. Uh, maybe you can help with that. Now that we have all this space, we can improve our workshop. I see. I think I might need to build a metal workbench first. <laughs> With that, I'll have the tools to build other machines. Sure, do what you need to do. All right. Very well. I see water over here, too. Pick up the water jug. Now, this is, I believe, the sinkhole that they are referring to. Yeah. There's a deer. A low deer. And there's people over there as well with masks. See those people? No idea what they want. No idea what... Who, ah! My God. Come on now. Don't freak me out as I walk down here. Wow, it's super, super, super um, <laughs> dark. Potato seeds, though. Hey, water jugs are going to be good to uh, water our plants. We have a crate. My Lord, it is extremely dark. Gasoline. More stuff in the stockpile down here. Yep, we'll take some of that. Inventory is a little bit um, forgiving in this game, which I do appreciate. Looks like we could build down here, too. If we really, really wanted to. Yo, that's actually where we should put it, like... That's where we should put our tent, I feel like. Down there. Can I change... Like, Can I, like, move my tent? I just feel like it's awkward. Like, it's just, like, in the way. Yeah. I'm putting my tent down there. I don't care what you say. I'm putting it down there. I'm gonna have my own... I'm gonna be isolated. I like it. Bam. There you go. In the dark area. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and make a little bit more on our uh, four by fours. Let's get that roll in here. Very easy. It's good that you don't have to like sit here and wait. For, uh, you know, these things like craft. You know how, like, you make things and it's like, oh my god, you gotta wait, like, ten seconds or whatever. Looks like we can make two by two columns, four by eight beams, hot tub. Uh, you can make a beer maturing station, and you can make a wooden crate that can store inventory items. But we're gonna make some more four by fours. Build this up. Make more planter boxes. It's the whole thing I want to do with the 40 seeds that I have, I guess. Yeah. There we are. We'll do 100 for now. That's good. Thank you. Uh, research. We can research. I think, I, well, it's about to hit 9 p.m. So we're, we can't do anything here in about like five seconds. I wonder if I can research at night. No, you cannot research at night. So you are too tired to research in general. Okay, very well. 
Okay, so everyone's now gonna like turn in for bed. It's like daytime still, even though at 9 p.m. Everybody's gonna turn in uh, for, for bed. You can't put anything in the food cellar when you're tired. This guy is doing something. Good for him. All right, let's go downstairs. Hey, Queen, how are you? Hey, James, how are you? Hey, Banpasa, how are you? Avon, Yvoni, Avoni, how are you? Fane, how are you? Meow, hello. Auntie Meow, Susie T, hello, how are you? Masumi, how are you? Makiki, how are you? <clears throat> we just sit here by ourselves because we're not like a tribe yet, I guess. All these different things. All right. Whoa. Okay. All right. Nice. Game saved. Okay, so that little bit of hiccup was the game saving. All right. So, um, yeah, let's continue with our planter boxes, please. And actually, thank you. Now, um... You might be like, so every time you want to build a planter box, you're going to have to, what? You're going to have to do this every time? And I, I don't think so. If I remember correctly from the last time I played this game, no, you don't have to do this every time. There will be um, an automated feature. I think obviously with the people that we have, you know, you can have, you can assign people to do it. But I, I may, might think that you, you don't have to assign them to do an automated feature. I'm not sure. I can't remember 100%. But you don't have to do this every time. If you're like, oh my god, I don't want to do this every single time. There is other ways to not have to worry about it. Okay, remember? Drag it and go across. There we go. Nice. Uh, let's go ahead and just plant these seeds in. Progress. Potato seeds. There we go. Actually put them stacked together. We're going to need the empty... Wait, is that empty? Oh, those are empty water jugs. Okay, we're going to need to fill those up. Okay, let's plant that. Potato. Potato. Good job. And I think we get our water from here, right? There we go. Water. Put our water jugs in there. Fill it up. Uh-oh. There we go. Okay, I don't know what I just did there. <laughs> right, okay. Okay, good. We got it all filled up. Wonderful. Again, I think this water is what we need for the... Yes, for the plants. Yep, no water over here. So let's go ahead and water them. There we go. There we go. Nice. Mission complete. Potato seeds have been planted. Very good. Was that Mo or was that Red? I think that was Mo that talked about it. Thanks for the help. Those potatoes look perfect. We will need a lot more, though. Yeah, I see this. Uh, farming is hard working, but I like it. Yeah, me too. I really enjoy uh, seeing something grow. Mo, can I ask you something personal? Yes, Nikki? Oh, by the way, our name is Nikki, I guess. <laughs> How did you end up here? I, I didn't read the, the actual name, Nikki. It's a long story. Maybe for some other time. Sure. Uh, why don't we set up a large farm to feed everyone, then? We could eventually sell produce in a farmer's market. I like that. Count on my help. So, very good. Character that has joined our community is Mo. So there's our first person. We did what he wanted, and uh, he has now joined us. So we have, like, kind of control over him in some degree. All right. A lot of tutorial things, right? Community. The first community has joined, or character has joined your community. Each character has a unique story. Talk to them frequent to discover their motivations. You will often open up new they will often open up new character can also uh, perform jobs assign jobs to the schedule panel these are the things that I'm talking about with the whole automated things uh, character job scheduling yeah so there's like a schedule that you could do in this game um, yeah kind of cool right job builds tell them to make some blueprints I like it this is the automated thing again uh, farming telling them to farm as well Build, farm, clear, produce. So, yeah. This is where it really gets, uh, like, the, the managing starts to get into it. Status effects. Your crew members can experience a series of emotions or afflictions. Some emotions will bring positive effects, while others might negatively affect their productivity. Bad status effects can be avoided by developing a beautiful settlement. Consider building rooms with some privacy, and consider building rooms with some privacy. 
and character as <laughs> consider building rooms with some privacy and consider building rooms with some privacy and character as well as offering decorations that community members might try to find to avoid bad emotions and build positive environment where your community can thrive. Okay. So, out of curiosity, if I place this down now, I can turn this into an order. Bam. So that is an order, right? So that will be done, but uh, Mr. Mr. Uh, Mo here needs the supplies, right? So that red crate, I'm pretty sure, is our community chest or community crate, community storage, right? Stockpile. If I put like, uh, let's see, if I put these four by four columns in there, he should be able to go in there and do his thing, no problem, um, eventually. So there we go. We'll put all this stuff in there. We don't need to have everything on us. Scrap metal, copper wire, dry leaves, I guess, uh, gasoline for the generators, uh, capacitors, cement what is this gravel uh empty jug we'll hold on to the empty jugs and then like we can put the seeds in there too i think that won't be a bad idea where did all our logs go i thought we had more raw lumber maybe not okay all right so mo hey nikki how can i help you uh wait a sec mo i want to go to community he's very upset okay he's very upset with what's going on now scheduling if we want to have his scheduling um, dictated by, by us past 1 p.m., we need to unlock some trust. <laughs> the only thing we can do is 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. So we can add a job and say, hey, I would like for you to maybe build during that time. The two, what was that, two hours, three hours? And then I would like for you to farm between that time. So build as soon as you, in the morning, build away. Build those planter boxes, and then uh, farm also. And when we, you know, get more trust with you, we'll we'll do more with you later. Uh, th they have a little bit of a description of him. So Mo is an avid farmer. He seems to have a connection to the soil and likes seeing things grow. He does seem to carry some unspoken sadness. There we go. Nice. Hello, Ash. What do you need? Oh, f me. Rhett, how are you? Hey, Nikki, how can I help? All right. Uh, let's just see. Where is the quest that we have now? Missions. Uh, craft a planner. That's the next thing. So install a planner machine to build panels. Uh, right. Let's see. Oh, can we actually talk to this guy finally? Hang on a sec. Alcott. Hello, kiddo. Uh, now we can finally have a proper introduction. My name is Alcott. Hey, Alcott. I'm Nikki. You seem to have a lot of interesting junk here. Junk? Nothing is junk if you find it you if you find a use for it. Are you looking for something? Maybe. Uh, can I see what you have? Sure, everything is for sale. If you find something interesting or even better, if you build something, I can probably get a good price for it. Get a good price? I got the flea, I got, I get to go to the flea market every week to trade. I can sell things you bring to me. Look, these have been selling really good lately, but I'm a bit too old to keep building them. Use these blueprints to make chairs. I'll buy them for you. So he gives us a blueprint of a chair that if we build, you know, and then make and give to him, he'll sell at a higher price at a flea market. But also, I mean, come on, the chair will actually make our civilization, hopefully, a little bit better. This is his stockpile and what he has um, for us to buy, which we will probably buy things from him very, very soon. Yeah, very, very soon. Uh, now thinking about it, give me my cash back. <laughs> Sorry. Give me my cash back. Oh, wait. I had it already on me. Never mind, never mind. I already had my cash on me. My bad. We'll put the capacitors back in there, though. There we go. All right. Oh, you know what? We should probably put the soil in there, too. So that uh, Mo can get that. There we go. Okay. Uh, blueprint is now a chair. Let's see. What do I need to build for a chair? Or what do I need to build a chair? Right? So you need a bunch of four by fours. Okay, we have plenty of those right now. Let's go like this, go up, go like this, go up, this and go up, up, cross. I don't know if I have enough. I hope to, I hope I have enough. Here we are. I don't know if I have enough. I don't think I have enough. Ah. I do have enough. Oh my lord. Was that perfect or not? 
That's a chair. <laughs> All right. Here you go, Alcott. Um, flea market. I can sell items that you make in the flea market. I'll take anything you make out of the raw wood on the saw table. If you build stuff from blueprints, I'm sure I can get a good price. Very good. I wish I could offer you more things to sell, but I don't have a good way of moving around. If you could help me acquire a van, I can expand the available items in the shop. I'll set up a contract to keep track of your contribution towards the van. Contracts will allow you to achieve larger goals over time. So buying a van, now that's one of our quests. Like one thing at a time here, right? So I guess the only thing uh, I can really do is just like sell him this chair. Right? So if how, how does this work? So sell the chair. How much will we get? $60 from that. There you go. There's your freaking chair, dude. You like that? There you go. $60. Sell the chair. Cool. All right. So that worked out. We do have a little bit of time before 9 p.m. So what I'm going to try to do is go into the tech tree here. And we want to get into, I think, machine manufacturing, which will take four hours, four in-game hours uh, to do. So that's good. We'll do that. Close that. And then you can fast forward time as you're sitting here with the research, which we will do until 9 p.m., right? Yeah, until 9 p.m. And then we can resume that when we want. Now, tomorrow in the morning time, this right here should be built. Uh, Mo should be able to build this planter with the stuff and the things that we provided him already in the stockpile. And then we should see it be farmed as well. You know what? We probably should put water jugs in there too. I'll do the watering. If, the, if anything, I'll do the watering, but that should be built in the morning time or he should be working on that if, the, if things go correctly. Okay, let's sleep. Hey, Brian, how you doing, Brian? It's a gorgeous chair. It is a gorgeous chair, right? <laughs> okay, so Mo is cold. Mo is motivated. So a couple things we get is Mo is cold and Mo is mo motivated. Very well. Okay, let's see. Let's see what happens. I'm kind of interested. Mo, you should be building, right? You build the, the planter box because I tell you to. Okay, now it's almost 9 a.m. That's when he starts working, right? 9 a.m. Okay, so we'll watch that. We'll go ahead and water this. Water that. Get that rolling. Now he's going. Look at him go. Look at him go. Yes. Good for you, Mo. Good for you. Yep. That's where I, that's where I put all the stuff. There. Fantastic. Great job. <laughs> <laughs> Okie dokie, art of freaking jokey. Very well. I'll finish up my research while he does that. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Okay, we'll do this. There we are. There. Now we research machine manufacturing. Awesome. Uh, yeah. So let's see here. Let's go blueprints. So these are things I think we can already make, right? If we really wanted to, we can make a, you know, all these balconies, a floor, a frame, uh, all this stuff. Okay, let's do it. Let's get it. So right here is the generic workbench, which will help us build the, what is it? The metal workbench. For the metal workbench, what do we need for this? What, what do we need? We need 30 scrap metal. One metal tool, one vice, and 20 raw panel, which we have. Oh, God. I saw you checking out the workbench there. Oh, is it yours? We share things here in the common. Feel free to use it. Oh, right. We used to be able to repair machines and build tools here. Take care of our needs, you know, not having to depend on shiny new objects all the time. I see, but this workbench looks broken. Yeah, we haven't been able to get the parts to repair it. I could try to fix it. That'd be great. It would give us more independence, allowing us to build new tools. Sure, then. I'll give it a shot to repair the workbench. Why don't you talk to Alcott? He's always talking about the wares he has found around. He might have something useful. Okay, so let's see here. If we want to repair this, we're going to need electronic tools, soldering tools, scrap metal, scrap metal. So I know Alcott sells electronic tools and solder sol soldering tools. My lord, isn't that crazy? 
What is the abbreviation for in common hood? Or is it just stylization? I have no idea. <laughs> Maybe stylization, I guess. <laughs> All right, so there's a few things that are... Uh, before I talk to uh, Mr. So-and-so and have him convince me to buy things from him, um, I'm going to pick up, yeah, like this, electronic tools. So we don't need to buy it straight up from him. We can just look around. There will be things that we can find that we can use for ourselves to repair this, uh, repair this bench. He can build a lot in those two hours. Okay, very good. I just wanted to see if it worked, and that, that's, that's good that it works. I come from uh, a, a time, the last time I played, I'm very hesitant with this, with this game, because the last time I played, it was, a, it was a lot. It was a lot of bugs, and there was a lot of game-breaking stuff. So I'm just kind of like letting, I'm, you know what, I'm doing it the other way. I'm holding the game's hand this time around because I don't want anything bad to happen. All right, let's actually just take it all, right? Small paper, canned food, resistor, take it all. There we go. Let's get some resources up here so that we don't have to come back down here. And there's a vice right there. Perfect. There go. Okay. More food up here also. Uh Oh, small, uh, small, a simple table. Oh, very good. Simple table. So now we can make a simple table. Oh, very good. Cool. Just found that blueprint. Just chilling. Is the game a lot different now since you played the beta? Have they done uh, good improvements? Uh, so far, everything seems the same. I haven't ran into bad bugs yet. Uh, I did get an email yesterday. Uh, saying that there was a bug, but they fixed it before launch, so that was uh, that was good to hear. There we go. But yeah, so far, nothing, uh, nothing too bad. Nothing bad yet. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, good. Let's go here. Just grab it all, right? Grab it all. Let's throw it in our stockpile. That'll be good. There we go. Clean up the area a bit. Nice. How long is our generator going to last for? Uh, it's at 59% fuel currently. We're going to need to get some gas for that soon. Now let's go ahead and... Uh... Well, actually, we want to hold on to a few things. Let's get some scrap metal with us. Yeah, let's. Go. well, actually, we already had a lot of scrap metal. We should be able to, to repair this right now. Let's do it. There's a hidden room along the back wall. Along the back wall? Uh, along the back wall where? There's a lot of walls here. Let's repair this. So first things first. Electronics. Soldering. Vi Wait, we don't need a vice for this. Do we not have any... Did we not get a single soldering? We didn't? Oh, yeah, yeah. We might have one, though. We might have one. No, we don't have one. Wow. I'm surprised. All right. Well, all right, Alcott. Time to purchase something from you. I would like to buy a soldering tool for $100. $100 for one soldering tool? My lord. Where's my cash? Hang on a sec. A $100. Why are you charge me so much? Bye. I bought two. Why did I buy two? Uh, because I accidentally bought two. Okay. Boom, and then... Boom, and boom. Alright, so we have completely repaired the workbench, finally. Oh, that's good. Alright. So let's see what, what that opened up. Community storage, right. Community storage great in each area. If you store items and materials here, other characters can use them for jobs. Good. Which in that case, honestly, I think uh, we should kind of plan these out a little bit more. Oh, look at that. The seeds have been planted. Very good. We'll go like, oh God, the workbench uh, looks as good as new. Yes, yes, it does. Yeah, glad to help. Looking to put, uh, looking to putting, looking to putting it in use anytime soon? Maybe, though I don't know what for yet. My dad and I used to build all sorts of things in our garage. Well, it sounds like you both are very close. 
Yes, I really miss him. I'm sure you do. Anyway, I'm not really good at this. Perhaps you could start to build electric motors? We always need more of those. Wait, what? What do you need motors for? Well, there is that crane in the back that has been broken forever. I was thinking maybe building some motors could help fix it. Also, if we need some money for food, those motors always sell well in the flea market. I see. I can uh, give it a shot. Great. You might need to find some scrap metal and wires. Try digging uh, out those piles of debris. I'm sure you could find some around. Again, remember to talk to Alcott. Uh, he will fix you with the things you might be missing. Add the motors to the community storage crate. There... Add the motors to the community storage crate there by the podium uh, once you are done. Podium? All right. So we will turn that into an order. This is basically all I want to do right now is make sure we get this rolling. Order. And order. And I'll make more. I'll make more. Um, I'll make more uh, four by fours. But I kind of want this to go through here. There we go. There we are. There we are. I think I want to go all the way to the end. There we go. That's a lot. <laughs> that is a lot. But we're going to need a lot of food anyways. There we go. Mo's gonna be pissed. Yes, he he's gonna be absolutely mad. And again, you don't have to do it the way I'm doing. You can always do it yourself. Uh, but you know, we got other things to do right now. There we go. Okay, let me make some four by fours at least. Okay, do this, and let's go here. We already have a ton of wood in here. Make sure you take your wood out, because you will uh, forget it, and then you will think you have none, but you might, might have a lot. So let's go here. Four by four. We'll build a bunch of this. We'll do this. Get Mo going. What does the generator do? The generator helps uh, operate these machines. Um, the machines can't work without the generator. I don't know how much wood he needs, but I'm going to do 200. There we go. All right. And then we'll put that in the storage. Yeah. Mm. Let's see. This goes into that. And then we'll add more soil. There we go. And we have plenty of seeds. That should be enough. Uh, we still probably will have a lot of seeds after that. Okay. So you say there's something upstairs on the very top floor. Yeah. Let's see. Let's see. I'm getting tired, so I won't be able to move anything if there's something I need to move up here. But there is something behind something. Ah, this. Well, this is weird. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> Debris. Uh, all right. How would Nikki know to do that? I don't know. Let's go back down. Hey, Marat. How you doing, Marat? Hey, Rackmar, how you doing, Rackmar? Oh, you know what? One thing we should do is put food in the cellar at the in the next day, because we do have canned foods. All right, we gotta go to bed. Sleep. <laughs> all right so plants are ready for harvest our first ever harvest is ready here that's good it only took what two days for the potatoes to, to get going right i think so I'll water that so these are good harvest harvest how much did that give us 10 potatoes so you get five each box oh huh. interesting okay food seller push this through and then push, I guess, yeah, potatoes, put them in there, too. There we go. Now our food is up to 42. Very good. Very good. Oop. Do that. Um, I guess we can go upstairs and see what that's all about. That wall, right? Hey, Lari. Hey, Lari. How you doing? All 
right. So you need a pickaxe in order to do that. All right, so we're not even near the pickaxe. We don't even have a pickaxe. We don't even know how to obtain a pickaxe yet. We're going to walk away from that for the time being until we get a pickaxe. Can I jump off here? No, you cannot jump. We haven't been outside yet. Let's go outside. Soil. <laughs> More soil. Very good. Well, a crate, too. Another crate. Wood glue, blades, and fuses. I'll take it all. Okay, now the small planters are now being built. Very good. Anything over here? More soil? Anything else? Nope. Very good. I guess this is the truck we showed up in. Possibly. Okay. So, uh, we need to focus more on making this metal work table now. So, for the metal work table, what do we need again? 30 scrap metal metal tools and a vise. Now, we do have scrap. We can put that in there. Uh, we do have a vise. We'll put that there. We do have uh, panels. We do not have the metal tools, which we can get from Alcott. Yeah. So, one thing I like is that when you do that, you can leave that stuff on the table until you come back. I do like that. That's a nice little feature. Okay, so I would like to buy a metal tool for 300, please. My lord, Trebek. Uh, I don't have 300. So instead, can I sell you some dry leaves? No, I cannot sell you any dry leaves. Okay, that's fine. We can we can build them chairs and, and tables and things like that. That's that, that's all right. We can do that. Hold that thought, buddy. All right, before we actually start building, though, we should probably uh, get more of this. Yep, more of the 4x4s. Four there we go. I think 100 should do for us. Yeah, 100 should do just fine. Honestly, I could, like, maybe even leave the wood on there. Wouldn't be too bad. All right. We could try building a, uh, a table also. I'm a little afraid, I'll be honest with you. Go ahead and grab that stuff real quick. Oh, did I not grab it? Whoops. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> Can I actually see? Table. Can you see what you need for the blueprint before you start doing the blueprint? Looks like I'm going to need panels. Yeah. We'll stick with the chair for now. It's an easy thing to build. We could turn it into an order. Um, but we'll do it ourselves. There we go. And then we'll talk to Mo again. Oh, God. I did that wrong. Uh, whoops. Cancel. I made that way too long. <clears throat> Be careful. Don't make it too long. There you go. But we'll talk to Mo. Uh, the more we can get Mo's trust up, the more he'll work for us, which is ultimately what we want anyways, right? There we are. And like I said, there's the sandbox mode in this game. And I think the sandbox mode is helped for, helped for you if you want to create your own type of blueprints and things like that in the game. Which again, I think is still pretty cool. Um, what happens if I say flea market? I can sell items to the flea market. I'll make anything out of... Okay, right. Okay. Yeah, alright. Yeah, okay. Contracts. Let's see what contracts he has. Buy the van for $3,500. Good for you. My lord. <laughs> I don't plan on doing that anytime soon right now. Sell you that for 60. There we go. That gives us what we need as far as metal tools. Bye. Thank you. And fix up this metal workbench thing. Or do it, right? <clears throat> I'd buy your drive leaves. <laughs> I'd buy your drive leaves. <laughs> All right. Build that. Have a good one, Voni. Avoni. Avone. Avoni. Ebony? Ebony. Maybe Ebony? Is that how you say it? Ebony? My lord, I have trouble with that name. Okay. Metal workbench now. Where should we put it? Honestly, we should put it right here. Back it right there. Boom. Nice. Metal workbench is good. 
Rhett's going to talk to me about this, no? Hey, Nikki, how can I help you? Oh, maybe not. Do you see the metal workbench, my good man? No? Okay. Or was this an Ash thing? Maybe it was an Ash thing. Ash, was it you? What do you need? You know, where? where's Mo at? Hang on a sec. Mo! There you are, Mo. Let's talk to you, buddy. Hands on now. Let me know how I can help. Okay. I thought we could do more with you. I think we might be able to if we go here, right? Maybe. Trust. That's his uh, improvised shelter, unfortunately. I mean, we're all in the same boat here, Mo. We're all, like, in the, in the tents. Don't be too upset about it. Okay. Now we can make metal discs... Uh, milling bits and then we can make other things like that there's so many things like a like a chop saw concrete mixer a planner which is absolutely what we need now we're gonna go here we're gonna go here let's not forget to pick up my stuff that I left on the other table yeah there there oh I need 50 of those oh whoops okay 50 of those metal that's that 20 a wire and 20 gears okay hold that thought let me pick this all up again thank you all right i should have this stuff though in the stockpile let's see um i don't do i not really do i not have it interesting 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 okay well then um Let's see here. I can unlock it during... I can, I can craft it if I do my research very well. I can make more of these, which needs scrap metal. Absolutely can do that. Yes, yes, yes. I need 10 of these. Good. And we need 10 of these, I think, too. Oh, my God. It goes so fast. I collect all that. That should be good. And then let's do more of that. And more of that. Oh, I need 30 of more of those. Okay. I need 10 more wires. So where what do, what do I need to do for the wires? Let's see here. Um uh, tech, what do I need for the wires? Maybe electronics. Fabrication. Fabrication. So there's the fabrication skill tech tree. Uh there's the uh I don't even know what the heck to call this, but Research, crafting, clearing, eagle eye. There's uh, skills, skills. There's culture, which you can make basics of cooking. There's ecology, where you can make uh, uh, plants and things like that, and composting, worms and things like that. So, I mean, there's there's a big skill tree in this game, ish. That looks like empty. That looks empty. Maybe in the future they'll add more, or maybe as you progress you'll get more. I don't know. There we go. But we should probably do electronics. This will give us the ability to actually build a soldering tool so that we didn't have to like purchase it for a, a ridiculous price, which I should have done, honestly. Go do this. Research. Electronics. Electronics, baby. Oh, look at that. Generic workbench. Okay, that's a generic workbench. There's the planner. Pipe bender. Okay. Table saw. We're good here. The only in this one right here, right? This, there we go. We have now the wires unlocked, which is just copper wire. Easy enough. Ten of those. Thank you. Ten of those and then 30 more. 30 more of the of the metal plates. Which we need. Scrap metal. There we go. Like that. There we go. Go. All right. Let me just sit here real quick. <laughs> Finally, you're playing this. It just came out today, right? Finally, I'm playing this. How you doing, Choco? Choco Holy. Okay. There we go. And then finish us off, yeah? Came out yesterday, today, one or the other. Uh, oh man, getting tired. No, I was about to finish that. No, I don't want to be tired. 
I don't want to finish what I have. Gosh darn it. I'm going to need more wood for them, huh? Yeah. You know what? Oh, wait. I can't get into the stockpile because I'm tired. Lord have mercy. <clears throat> you get to go in the outside world? I don't know. I've never, uh, you know, I've only gone so far in this game. I don't know. I do not know the answers. Am I the only one that is still stuck at the don't forget to take your wood out sentence? Um, what? <laughs> Look at that though. We actually sit with somebody now that we are, we are, have a community. Uh, we, we sit with people. I mean, I know the other people don't want to uh, sit with us because I guess they're not part of our community. Wish Hoko Life had the same building crafting technique. Make sure we water our stuff here. There we go. There we go. <clears throat> there we go. And then let's go ahead and throw in these columns. Yep. Add more for the person. Yep. For the person. For the guy. For the doohickey. I think we should be good. Okay, let's do... Grab me that, thank you. Put that in. There we go. That's good to go. Alright, so we can build... The planner. Build the planner, yep. Building the planner now. Let's go... Okay, got the planner. Where am I going to put the planner? <laughs> All this room and no... Oh, well, not even a lot of room. We don't have that much room. Uh, let's put it right there. I guess. There we go. I want to keep all these things, like, together. So there we go. Our, our planner has now been crafted. Now Ash will come to us. This machine was not easy. I had to read some books to put it together. Impressive. So, what do you uh, plan to use it for? Well, with these machines, we can make wood panels. With panels, we can make floor platforms, walls, and rooms. I see. We can probably use it for a bridge, too, right? A bridge? Across the sinkhole. Perhaps. Talk to Alcon about that. Uh, he might be able to help you. For now, do you think you can build a few floor modules? Uh, they would be great to avoid the humidity. Let's get started with four floor modules. All right, I can give it a shot. Do you mind if I use the planner for the bridge idea? Uh, <laughs> do you mind? You just built it. <laughs> you better not mind. <laughs> of course not. You built it after all. Exactly. <laughs> all right, so we have a uh, we have floor planners now. Okay, so build a floor panel module. We're gonna need one inch panels, right? Is that one inch panels? For that, we're gonna need raw uh, panels. Okay. I don't know how much we need, but I'm going to be, I'm going to make like, I don't know, maybe a hundred. Yeah, we'll do a hundred. That should be fine. Okay. We'll work with that first. And we'll build the panels off over here because it's wide open, right? Was Hoko early access? Hoko is not early, early access anymore. No. Okay, let's go here. Ah! You need four by fours. Very well. I don't think I have enough. So, again, out of curiosity, can I, like, interact with anything? So, if I cancel this, it just straight up cancels, right? Okay, straight up cancels. Let me go make some more four by fours. Uh, four by four. I put, I literally just left the wood in there because I know we're going to just use this quite a bit. Nice. All right. Come back over here. Right again. Okay. We'll make this out. Oh, God. 10 feet by 9.3 feet <laughs> by 10 feet. 9.3 feet. I guess it makes up for the uh, I get it. Uh, what is this for? What, 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 what is this? What is this? What is this? What, what is this asking? Oh, go up. No, no, that doesn't go up. 
Just corner pieces, I guess. There we go. Right? And then we put the panel in. Yeah, then we put the panel in. There we go. All right, so we, we, we've made, uh, you know, <laughs> a little bit of a platform, yeah? And I'm going to water my crops over here? No, he's got it. Uh, Ash, I, I, I did it. Do you see it? How many do I need to make? Did she say exactly how many? Four of them. Oh, my Lord. Okay, she needs a lot. Gotcha. Gotcha, girl. Okay, I'm going to need more of um, more panels, though. Hang on a sec. We're going to need more of this. Yep. We're going to need a lot more. I guess 100 wasn't enough. So we're going to need, like, maybe 300 more. Hey, Alex. How you doing? I'll just sit here. I'm not an alien. I'm just a figment of your imagination. That's it. That's all I am. <laughs> okay. Let's go here and place that there. And then we'll go call him again. No. Probably should have made more 4x4 four four maybe. No, we, we should be okay. we go there we go and then go for the panel actually time out did i not pick up the panel oh frick dude did i forget to pick up the panel no i got it no i got it i just don't have it i just didn't put it in my inventory okay got it we're good we're good we're good we're good we're good okay panel column there we go panel all the way across. There we go. Very good. Do it two more times. <laughs> and I know I could like give this to Mo, but you know, Mo's busy right now. He's very busy. Okay. Same concept. I will say though, this this building, you know, I see Hoko life being shared in the chat. Um I would say this is still easier, probably, right? There we go. across perfect i need more uh four by fours go here you can pick them up once made so you have all four yeah 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 if you're talking about like picking up the uh actual um the uh when i make them yeah you can pick them up yeah sometimes you gotta do the grunt work yourself you're right about that, Peyton. <laughs> You're right about that. How are you doing? Oh, you hear that? How dare you bark in my house? You shall not be, uh... No, no, no. You do not have a... Th really? Did I not pick up that? God damn it. I keep forgetting to do that. I feel like in most games, it's like when you're, when you're done, you're done. Right? No. <laughs> You hear that? You hear that? Hey! Yeah. Tell me about it. You you tell me all about it. Someone there? I bet you there isn't. I bet you nobody's there. Okay. Like that. Like this. All the way over. And I don't know if maybe you place the tents on these little uh, panels here that uh you know it will make them more comfortable you know because they're like oh we're off the ground at least i don't know maybe there we go good job we did it hooray <laughs> um yeah let's finish off the rest of the evening with research possibly go. open up the tech tree and we will do um Remove debris faster. I kind of like that. Develop research faster. I really like that. Let's do that one. For nine hours? Oh, F me sideways. Lord have mercy. All right. Well, we'll do a little bit of it. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Till 9 p.m. Maybe it's the guy knocking again. Oh, this time, I I put a I put a sign out on my door. I said, "Do not knock." Please. Well, I didn't say that. I said, "Please do not knock." I work from home. Please do not knock. Please and thank you. And I went outside to see what the hell happened. He likes. It's like one of the, one of the um, what do they call him? One of the person that goes around the park and uh, like does maintenance and stuff. It's a maintenance guy, you could say. And he like came and like I, I was like wonder what he went out there for. I went I went outside and like my trash cans got spray painted. Like he spray painted them because I think he's putting numbers on them or something. I don't know. I just saw that he painted them, and I think he's coming back later today. So I made sure to like, please don't knock on the door. <laughs> you don't need to tell me that you're spray painting my. Uh, my garbage cans. It's fine. I don't really care. I just put trash in anyways. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. There we go. I, I don't think I need to do this, actually. I don't. I, I think I could just, like, keep it in my inventory and just fill it up that way. Oh, picking them up should end the quest now. Pack them up. Hooray! Build them. Now she... Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. She's coming for me. She's coming for me. Look at her. It's in her eyes. She's coming. I won't let her. I won't let her. I won't let her. She's coming. I won't let her. No. Hide. <laughs> oh, no. There she is. Like a horror game. So what are these platforms for? These platforms can be uh, the foundations of a better home for all of us. There is a wave of evictions out there and people naturally end up in this place. So we can build shelters, yeah? Exactly, but we haven't figured out how. Here are some floor and wall modules we have been working on. Maybe you can figure out how to put them together. And here is a blueprint we've been using. Okay. Have you ever built a house before? <laughs> Does a tree house count? I guess, why don't we start with a prototype, a model we can use. It can be just a room, to be honest. We can build up from that. Okay, I'll do my best. Well, that might be more than what we have been able to put together. If you lead the way, I would happy. I, I would I would be happy to help. This place needs your energy, okay. Join, yeah, right on. So we have Ash. Ash is now joined on in our community. Well, thank you, Ash. I guess we can learn more about Ash. Let's see. Um, yeah, let's learn more about Ash. Community. Ash. Ash. After a wealthy life, Ash ended up with nothing after being betrayed by her loved ones. Uh, okay. That sounds actually terrible. We'll add a job. Um, build clear farm produce. What is produce? This person will go to an unoccupied production machine. And produce the recipe selected from that machine. Ah, that's really good. Oh, research. This character will be used as a research site and help with progress on research. Oh, that's incredible too. Uh, so, okay, let's do like a couple hours here, maybe. Uh, wait a sec. Pull that down? No. There we go. A couple hours of building in the morning. And then uh, do some research on my behalf. Yeah, I like that. There we go. Please and thank you. And then over here, grab some more water. All right, grab some more water. There we go. And we will water that. Water that. Looks like we need more um, more four by fours uh, built too. There we go. Do a little bit of this. Make a little love. Get down tonight. Yes, yes, yes. You know what I'm talking about. <clears throat> Please do not knock on my door. Ring the doorbell instead. I don't have a doorbell. <laughs> I don't have a doorbell. If I did, the dogs would even go in more chaotic, like, pandemonium. They'd go into, like, cardiac arrest. They'd be way too excited with a doorbell. Uh, one more. 200 should be fine. Go. 
We'll put this stuff away. There we go. Put that in there. Put that in there. So, uh, the other blueprint now we need to worry about, kind of, is this dealio. Wait, what is this? Alpha floor module. Wait, why is there... Is there six? No, there's four. Okay, there's four. Oh, she gave us uh, six floor modules. Wait a sec. Did she give us... I guess she gave us some stuff? Hang on. Let's put these blueprints off down to the bottom here. It looks like she did give us some stuff. She gave us six more floor modules, and she gave us six wall modules. Okay. Let's see how this works. You can build like a little house, office? I don't even know, dude. So, if I were to build something, maybe I can build something like right here. Snap it. So, four. How many walls? We have six walls. Let's see. If I did four and then did this... Right? Perfect, I guess. Are we doing something right? <laughs> that doesn't look right. Okay, you got to do it inside. Okay, you got to do it inside. Let's pull that back, I guess. This wall doesn't uh, fully do it for us, I don't think. No, it doesn't. I think what they want us to do is just make a box. Like a little tiny box. Instead of, like, going across like you would. Like, oh, yeah, go across because that wouldn't make sense. Okay, so they want us to make, like, literally a tiny little box. Right. Okay. There we are. That lines up perfect. There we are. I, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Dude. Oh, that's backwards. I don't know. It just doesn't feel right. That doesn't feel right. None of this feels right. None of this feels like it lines up correctly either. Okay, hang on a second. Let's do the outside rim. Outside rim. That's better. That's not better. Okay. Well, interesting. Uh, yeah. Very interesting indeed. Not exactly what I was hoping. Like, it would have to go, like, right there, right? Uh-oh. 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 Did I bug it? Uh-oh. I think I bugged it. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, yeah. Post the corners. That's good. Yeah, fill the gap with the 4x4. Yeah, that's good. I think I bugged that, though. Okay, let's water that. I guess we could do that. Let's see. Let's go. Um, oh, I hate this. This is annoying now. Um, yeah, for just, like, sake, let's go. Maybe we can do that, then. We can go to... We can make a bigger one, right? And then this, I don't know which, which row, God, Lord. I don't know which way this is facing. Like, I don't know what's inside out. It's hard to tell. I guess this is the right way. Like that. Is that the right way? Okay, that is the right way. Okay, same thing. Oh my god, not the same way. Look at the inside out, didn't it? God, gosh darn it. Okay. Try again. Rotate. Okay, there we go. Is it? Okay. Right there. Okay. We'll see if this works. Again, I, I guess this is the right way. Facing the right way. Is it the right way? Good, it is. Okay. Go like this. Not the right way. Thank you. Okay. Um, let's go like this. Like that. Right? 
And then this is just completely in the way. Okay. And then I guess you would just do the two, uh, the 4x4 four four there, right? You just like slide it through. Whoop. Right up to the top. And then somehow make a door. Right? Make some more. Thirty. I read somewhere to record your do doorbell and then play it randomly throughout the day and don't react to it, and the dogs will start to get used to not reacting to it anymore. <laughs> that sounds like too much work. You would think they would like get used to the whole fact that you know I don't know, maybe the freaking garbage truck comes every once a week. They're not used to that. They're not used to that at all. What the. F Okay, that, I mean, that that's fine, right? That looks okay. Right? Right? Okay, hang on a sec. Let's save the game real quick. We will do LP, yo. We'll save the game, and I'll reload the game, and maybe that will get rid of that ridiculous black thing there that's, like, tripping out. We'll do that. Hey, it worked. Very good. Okay, it doesn't look too bad now that we put these 4x4s four in here, right? It works. Definitely for sure. Now we just need a door, right? Just needs a door. Okay, build three mo motors now. We need to build three motors. We do that here, right? Chop saw, lath, lathe, machine workbench. We might have to make a machine workbench to make the motors. Right? Or is the motors here? The motors are here. Electric motors. What do we need for that? Five gears, five scrap metal. Okay. Um, we have the scrap metal. You can hit control that. That's that's a wonderful feature right there. Control click and that will automatically put what needs to be go. Yeah, thank you for that. Um do, 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 some gears. Do we not have gears? We might not have any gears. We have gears. Okay, uh, scrap, gears, electrical wire. Electrical wire, damn it, we need more. Five of that, hang on a sec. Five, please. Okay, perfect. And now let's make it. Well, I guess that only makes one, huh? We're gonna need three of that. Okay, so time out. Let's do 10. There we go. 15. We're going to need more gears. Should be 10 more as well. Perfect. There we are. There we are. And now let's make the motors. Boom. 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 Three of these, please. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> I made two. I made two, but I didn't make three because it's 9 p.m. All right. Very, very well. Very well indeed. But hey, at least we have a new worker that's going to help us in the, mor in the morning. And oh my effing god. There we go. Okay. <laughs> All right. There we go. Okie dokie. All right. Let's go to bed now. Hey, Darren. How you doing, Darren? This is ninth grade uh, shop class simulator. Facts, dude. I have three, three en high energy dogs. <laughs> Bunch of things ready for harvest. We're gonna have a lot of food here before we know it, which is not bad. There we are. Harvest, 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 and harvest. Good. Those should be uh, done here in a sec. Put the food in the cellar. 
Thank you. Okay, so that's done. We need to get our electrical motors now. One more electrical motor. Should do it. Do I do it here? I do it here. One more, please. Okay, collect all. Okay, we have the three electrical motors. Now all we need to do is place it in the community storage, I guess. Perfect. All right. That is done. Mission complete. Rhett, what do you got for me, buddy? Nice, tr <laughs> nice job with those motors. Your father taught you well. I think I could still improve, though. This is good for now. You should try selling some and buy some food. Food is always scarce here, but if people don't have food, they get frustrated and leave. But back to our original task. What about trying to fix that large crane? It sounds ambitious. I'm not sure if I can do that. You don't need to fix the whole thing. I think the problem is, is with the control panel. Something is not uh, wired right. That's something I can do. I always uh, was good with wires. My father didn't have the patience, so he always let me sort them out. Sounds dangerous. Nah, I know how to uh, keep things safe. Leave it to me. Okay, if we manage to fix that crane, we should be able to move some large items around. Would really help him. Re would really help. Imagine if we could do this place. That, like, what are we gonna move around here? Like, what large items are are you wanting to move? Like, what the frick is happening over here? Very good. Okay, operate. So to repair the crane, we're going to need an electric motor, which is ridiculous because I just like put the electric motor in the freaking storage, community storage, and I have to go back and take it out. But we're going to need a microcontroller and two wires. So microcontroller and two wires. Microcontroller we cannot do until we unlock it. So we're going to need more advanced... Um, advanced technology let's go ahead and uh get our research done here which makes our research faster okay good job and then we will do advanced electronics yep there we go probably do this for the rest of the day we can get our microcontroller low power uh that's interesting i think it's because we don't have or our fuel has officially ran out now right yeah our fuel is at apparently negative one <laughs> negative 0.01 percent i don't even know how to like comprehend that in real life <laughs> one thing i should do too is like think about like this there we go that looks good how do you comprehend not having 0.01 percent of something Okay. Okay, don't I don't want to hold that. Thank you. Okay, let's go to bed. Go to bed. That's just weird. Are they making out or hammering? <laughs> Are they making out or hammering? It's like that's the new hammer time. Like you want to get smashed. That's one way how to get smashed. A lot of things are ready to harvest. We have so much food. I feel like it's a good problem. Absolutely a good problem. Do all this. The water. Yep. Hey Cassie, how you doing? Hey, Matthew, how you doing? So this chick can build electric motors from scratch, but basic st structures, nope. <laughs> Let's go here. Yeah. All right. Let's go here. Harvest, harvest. Uh, nope. Harvest, harvest, harvest. All right. <clears throat> Very good put you in there right in there how much food do we got 126 we're doing good we have some gasoline we'll put some gasoline in here right so let's see here interact with this and then repair it with my lord four things of gas i go like this what did i just do what did i just do where did it go where did it go where did my gas go
Where did my gas go? Dude, I had like six of them. What the frick just happened? Excuse me. Now I have one? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Lois, this is not my Batman cup. Okay, what the frick just happened? All right, I guess fuel just disappeared. Thank you for that. Appreciate it. No problem. Did I drop it next to you? Let's see. Does it seem to be? <laughs> I don't know. I guess I guess we just lost all that gas. That's a little unfortunate. Okay, um right. All right. I don't know what happened to it. Very well. Let's finish off our research. 37 minutes. Done, baby. All right. Microcontroller. We need at least one microcontroller. We need, um, okay, we need that, we need that, so we have that, uh, we have that, capacitor, resistor, don't even get me started with this stuff, this is what I used to sell all the time at Radio Shack, fuses, capacitors, resistors, I just need a little bit of electric wire is all. There we go. Okay, let's get this. I'm not clicking any button like I did last time because that's how my gas disappeared, I guess. Um. Oh, do I not have any capacitors? Capacitors? Uh, yep, there we go. And I might, I need that motor too. Just give me one. Can I just take one? How do I take one? Shift click? No? I just want one. Alright, I'll take it all. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, I'll take it all. Oh, look at that. The research being done for us. Uh, honestly, I do not know if research is... I have anything selected. So you might be researching nothing right now. You might be just reading a book of like, eat, pray, love. I have no idea what you are doing. Okay. Let's go here. Build that. I only need one of those. Good. Control click. That's what I was pressing. I was pressing control click, but then it, it wasn't seem to working. Be working. Okay, let's do it. Here we are. Okay. Like this doesn't even work for control click. Interesting. There we go. Uh. Did I not make the wires? I thought I made the wires. I thought I made five wires. Oh, maybe I made five wires for the microcontroller. My bad. Okay. There we go. Honestly, I should, like, just make a bunch of wires just to have. Just so I don't have to, like, you know, worry about too much. Okay. Boom and boom. There we go. We have now repaired the crane. Oh, God. I don't want to... Oh, I don't want to... I don't want to do this. <laughs> I don't want to control this thing. I don't trust myself. Hell to the no. Red! You did it! I told you I was good with wires. Nice, you are bringing some energy to this place. Don't be shy, it's true. This place has been a dump for years. As I said before, my parents used to work here. I was hoping I could look around more to see if I could uh, find some of the stuff they left behind. I have a lot of memories here. You think after 15 years your parents might have left some stuff behind here? That's very hopeful, wishful thinking there. Well, you will need to find a way to cross that sinkhole. We have explored this area, but there is no way around it. People say that the factory is huge. There might all be all sorts of things we can use on the other side. Perhaps we could build a bridge. The crane can help us place it across the sinkhole, yeah? A bridge? I can do the trick. You'll need a lot of wood for that. Uh, count with me. I'll count with me. One, two, three. I'll help you out with building the bridge and explore the factory. Cool, so Rhett has now joined our community as well. Thank you, Rhett. Nice. So, what do we need to do? Build a bridge now? Cross the sinkhole. There might be something interesting on the other side of the factory, but the only way to know is crossing the huge sinkhole. Now, do they... Do they just expect us... 
to just flat out build a bridge or like do they want us to do a blueprint? How, how do they want us to do this? Research, though. Open the tech tree and make sure that we are doing doing it, doing it, doing it well. Um, crafting. Increase crafting speed. Okay. Culture. Cooking. Technology. No, thank you. Uh, probably the next thing we want to do is machine manufacturing. That's. I would assume that's the next thing. There we go. Are we missing items for this? Do we need more? Do we need more items needed? I think so. More 4x4s? Four Here we are. Talk to the shop dude to unlock the next part and do it in stages? Oh. In stages, yeah? I'll get to you here in a sec, Alcott. Let me put this away. Go, bam. Are we good on soil? We're good on soil. We're running out of potato seeds, though. Yeah. Speaking of the sinkhole, uh, the hurricane created an actual sinkhole on Interstate 4 in the Lando area this morning. Holy crap, really? It actually created a sinkhole on I-4? That is crazy. That's insane. Hey, Maggie. How you doing, Maggie? Alcott, right? That's me. I spoke with Ash about building a bridge to cross the sinkhole. She said that you might be able to help. Ah, yes, I have been thinking the same thing for quite some time, but unfortunately, we would need a planner to prepare some wooden panels. But you see, we already have one. I built one myself. Oh dear, that is certainly convenient. Uh, so yes, I have been drafting ideas for a bridge. I calculated the length of the sinkhole on the shortest edge, but the bridge needs to be built in sections. Each section uses a series of parts, so this task is actually no joke. Got it. Sure, sure. Uh, here are the blueprints you need to build one section of the bridge. You will need to. You will need one base, two rail sections. Uh, once you have them, you will be able to use this blueprint to build a full bridge. Come back once you have finished a bridge section with railing. All right. So I'm a little interested on this. So railing section. Okay. What do we have here? We have. A bridge section, bridge section with railing. Well, why wouldn't we just do this all in one set? Do we need to do these two first to make that? Yeah, we do. I see. Okay, so uh, first things first. Blueprint, I guess, for this section. How many do we need? Does it say again how much do we need? Build a bridge? Do, 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 do. No, okay. Okay. All right. Place. We're going to need four by eight beams. Okay. All right. Cancel. <laughs> four by eight beams. Something we have not done yet. And we do not even have unlocked. We're going to need heavy timber for that. How would one get heavy timber? Not here, obviously. You need heavy timber? This you just need raw lumber. But you need heavy timber for that. So let's see here. Planner? Drywall. No. Generic. Carpentry workbench. Workbench for developing furniture and prototype type of other workbenches. Okay, no. Metal workbench, probably not. Oh, chop saw, maybe. Trim lumber at various angles. A lathe. Machine workbench. Pipe bender. No, we don't need a pipe bender. Oh, four by eight's done by researching? Okay. Let's see here. Let's do some research on the machine manufacturing. And then um, I'll go back to that in the morning. I like how now we have everybody here, right? Everybody decided to join. Everybody's fine. Everybody's good. Everybody's happy. They're happy to be here. Well, maybe not happy to be here, but they're happy to be amongst each other now, right? Food is good. We're looking good on food. Let's do some research. P. 
People seem motivated, but also people seem cold. And I think that I guess the one way to kind of take care of the cold is like build them these little structures and a bed and thing like things like that, like a ceiling and put a ceiling where these little rooms are. I don't know, maybe something like that. Research completed for the machine manufacturing. Okay, let's see here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, fabrication. Uh, okay, heavy timber. <clears throat> yeah, we'll do that. Just to see. Fermentation. You can do fermentation in this game. Alright, let's pump this out real quick. And then we'll pump the other thing out. You get the heavy timber. Oh, it's already 9 p.m.? What the frick? Huh? It's already 9 p.m.? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I don't believe that. What the? What time was it when I sat down there? I feel like I just went to bed. Maybe not. Maybe that was my fault. Maybe I just lost track of time. Holy crap. That was quick. Super fast. Super fast. <laughs> One way to lose freaking time. All right. Try it again. Get this heavy timber in. I'll harvest everything that needs to be harvested before I even touch this thing. This, like, research table. Didn't you know reading books makes time go by so fast? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, one more. I don't think I'm going to have enough seeds anymore. I think we're going to be out of seeds here in a bit. Yeah. Come on. There you go. Okay. Let's harvest the potatoes. It'd be interesting if, like, the, um, the AI could harvest the potatoes or something like that, but let's not ask for too much here, right? Oh, God. That's the wrong place. Even though, you know what? Put some leaves in there while we're at it. Time flies when you're having fun. That, too. Oh, there, look it. What the frick? There's the gasoline. <laughs> I don't know how the gasoline ended up in the food cellar. Uh, does anybody know that? I, Jesus, what the hell? <laughs> the gas ended up from generator to the, I don't know, dude. <laughs> oh my Lord. I don't know. It worked out though. Figured it out. We found out where it went. Apparently it went in there. I say BS, but there it is. Okay. Heavy timber. Eight hours. Should take eight hours. At least I found it, right? Yeah, at least I found it. Yeah, that's a good point. They can harvest the potatoes. It's Mo's job. Okay, very well. All right, so heavy timber is done. Four by eight column. How many do we need? Don't know. I'm going to make maybe 50-ish. Yeah. Is there any way to make more potato seeds? I don't think there is a way to make more potato seeds. I don't know. <clears throat> but you'll be able to buy more. You'll be able to buy more seeds, as is. Okay, let's do this. Yo, this is ridiculous. I keep hitting the collect all, no? I have it in my hotbar. What the hell am I thinking? Here we go. Okay. 10 feet, 10 feet, and then uh, panels. 
We should have panels on us, I think, right? Pretty sure. Yeah, we have plenty of panels. There we go. <gasps> Not enough. We don't have enough panels. Okay, okay. Time out. Just hold a sec. Let me make more panels, please. Do a lot. A lot. The the panel like it, it it definitely is consumed at a high rate. I'm gonna run out of raw uh what is this called? Raw yeah, raw panels. Okay, bring that with me please. Thank you. I'll leave that in there. Okay. One section of the bridge. Try again. There we go. Excuse me. Excuse me? Excuse me? Okay. Come on now. Come on. Okay. You can work. You got it. There you go. Good job. Perfect. Okay. One section of the bridge built. Now, let's build the uh, railing section. <laughs> Couple of these, no? The frick is there? We need uh, four by four for this. Oh, damn it. Do I not have any four by four? I really wish like it, the blueprint would tell you your ingredients, what you need before you place it down. So you don't, uh, so you're not like constantly like running back and forth. Like a sliver of like wood sitting right there. don't exactly need more potato seeds as they just keep growing forever once planted more seeds is only if you want more plants wait what do you mean by that whoa what the heck is this we get some uh beets or something yeah now as a farmer i should be able to put the water Right? The water jug's in the storage and they should be able to do it no problem, right? Here we go. Yeah, they should be able to do this by themselves. I guess I could take this out because they don't need that anymore. Can't you clear out large dirt piles? I believe there is a guy behind them that sells seeds. Uh, yeah, the, the guy behind him, um, I mean, back in the early days, yeah, we needed this, but he, or he would be like, he was right here in the early version last time I played this, uh, but you have to have a pickaxe to, to clear that out. Okay, let's make some more four by fours. Hey, oh. Hey Lily. Today wasn't a good day. I had to sent I did get sent home to take a mental health day, so I'm hoping Kansas and everyone can cheer me up. Oh very well. Hope you're doing alright there, Lily. Changes keep people on their toes, yeah. <laughs> I think uh when we when I played the last time I, I think I'm telling I think it was back in March when I played this game. Um uh, I think they, they, they had that person there because I think they wanted us to know about, like, the trading system. I don't even know. Or, like, the plants or seeds, or they wanted us to experiment. I don't know why they changed it, personally, but... Okay, let's try it. Four by four. There we go. Four by four. It is a very, like... I would have to assume this game is a very complex kind of game to code. Right? There's a lot going on here. There we go. 
So there's one railing. We're gonna need another one. But yeah, so far right now, I do not think there's controller support. I do hope they add controller support. Um, but I don't know. We'll have to see. Here we go. There we are. Okay. That's done. Hey! Blessings upon everyone in chat today. Heading back to work. That was very kind of you, Darren. And I hope you have a good rest of your day at work. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Do take care for that. And thank you so much for the super chat. Appreciate that. And yes, exactly, exactly, exactly what uh, what Darren said. And all between. Absolutely. So this should go like this, right? Bam. Right? Ah, damn it. Okay. Cancel that. Cancel that, too. Ah! Oh, don't tell me you're stuck there again. Ay, ay, ay. More 4 by 8s Give me a sec while I chop some wood or, you know, do some wood here. Takes a bit. Bit of time. <laughs> I want to get maybe 100. I think 100 would be fine. Now, the, this, this other blueprint. I was thinking that I thought you could put these two things together. And maybe that is how it is. I just haven't gotten to that point yet. Okay, let's try it again. Okay, this is just wrong. Hang on, let's save the game. Let's reload this. Hang on a sec. Okay. Load it. See if that gets rid of that little weird thing. There we go. There we go. Okay. Let's go like that. And then let's fix this out. Yeah. There, okay. On this side. Okay. Oh my god. Let me, I just want to like get into my inventory and like add the extra stack that I have on me right now. Yeah, like right there. Lord have mercy, please. Put it in there. There you go. All right, try it again. Bam. Here we go. Boom. <laughs> Boom. Okay. Great, great, great. This should be enough now. All right. Uh, bridge section. Yes. Place that. Uh, railing. Yep. Railing. Yep. There we go. Okay, good. So we have a, like, one tiny little section. I think we need two, I think is what they said, right? Two. But mission complete. Use the crane in... Bridge. Wait, do they actually want us to use that one thing? That doesn't look long enough. Okay, I finished the bridge section. I can now see how much work it will take to finish the whole bridge. Indeed, uh, but this is good. I spoke with the others. It's all in interest to finish the bridge and see what uh, we can find on the other side. Let's get to work. Hopefully they give me a number. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you expect to find on the other side there, Nikki? I have these vague memories. There was a little garden where I used to play. My mom would look at me from a window, high from the administration wing. I hope you don't get disappointed. Wait, there was a garden? In this, like, met glass warehouse? I hope you don't get disappointed. Okay. One thing I am, like, interested about is, yeah, like, how far or how long does this bridge have to be? I don't know. I'm assuming we put it right here, right? Yeah? This is uncharted territory. I, I'll be real with you. This is very much uncharted territory. So I, I assume we need to make like three. 
Three, yeah? They will take care of it. Just talk to him again. Oh, talk to him again. Really? They'll take care of it? That was a fun session. I haven't seen everyone so motivated. I agree. I like working with friends. You have brought something special here, Nikki. So here, all the bridge sections you will need to put together the full bridge. You will need to clear a lot of space below the crane. Once you have the bridge uh, in place, use the crane to lift it. Here's the blueprint for the entire bridge. I hope my calculations were right. Thanks for all the help. See you on the other side, Alcott. Very well. Very strange. Okay. Watch, I'm not going to have like a enough room to place this son of a gun, am I? Ten? Holy crap. Ten? My lord. Ten bridge sections. Right. Oh, crap. How long is this? Okay. Where am I supposed to build this? I have to like move everything out here? Because I can't build randomly somewhere else. So I have to like move. Okay. What was the point of building this then? Move this out of the way. Oh my god. I have to move the planter boxes too. I gotta move everything. Uh, crap. No, I don't want to move everything. I don't want to move this stuff. I can't even move it because it contains an item inside of it. Oh my god. Why? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> why why just why why do this to us what okay all right maybe the game didn't expect me to like build this many plants boxes things and i, I all right i can see that but now i just gotta wait for these things to get done i guess in the meantime um I can uh, do research. Cool, dude. We'll do some research while we wait till tomorrow because I can't touch them, right? I can't touch them until they're they're done because there's something inside of them. They did say it was a big sinkhole. <laughs> I mean, look at it. Pretty big. Hey, Stephanie. How you doing, Stephanie? I was playing the coffee shop game and created a coffee called I Can's Do It. <laughs> what did you have in that coffee? What, what, what was in that coffee? Hey, Autumn. How you doing, Autumn? All right, let's see here. Plants ready for harvest. I guess, like, harvest them and then take them out completely, right? And this. Okay, is that enough room? Yeah. Holy hell. Right. There we go. Jesus Christ. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Place it. Okay. 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 All right. We have the bridge up. We have the bridge up. Use the crane and cross and wait. Use the crane and bridge to cross the sinkhole. Okay, this is where things get dangerous. 
Honestly, I wish I had a better view. Can I have a better view? There we go. This is where things get too dangerous. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. Talk to the shop guy again. There's a little bit of lack, lack of direction in this game. I, I see it. If I didn't have chat here, this would be like people would get lost in what they were doing. 100%. Especially when it says use the crane in the bridge. Not go talk to him. Unless I'm not supposed to talk to him. Never mind. F. You don't do that part? You talk to the shop, dude? He has nothing for me? It was an even blend of bitter and sweet. The perfect drink, in my opinion. Maybe the other guy? Whoa. Nope. Nope. I think the game wants us to use it. Use or lose it. Use or lose it, right? Use it or lose it. Bittersweet, the perfect drink in my opinion to give you enough bon uh, booze to get through the day. Students and business people bought most of it. I'm assuming this is just not correct, but I mean, it doesn't even make sense how I would even hook this to the bridge anyway. So I probably have to like put some sort of hook on it. There you go. That's how you do it. You put cables on it. I'm so glad I don't have to do that myself. <laughs> I'm glad the game does it for me. I did not want to do that. Well, we made a bridge. That's good. What is on the other side? What is on the other side of the factory? Obviously, on the other side of the factory is the world's largest chocolate uh, waterfall. Come on now. We should know this by now. Uh, new areas. You have open access to new regions of the factory. New regions will offer new resources and potentially new... New... And potentially new? New regions will offer new resources and potentially new companions. Why do they repeat themselves? So make sure to explore them in detail. When you sleep in a new area, that area will become your home base and other community members will follow you and help you develop it. Take a tent with you to explore. It might become handy. Squatters. You will encounter squatters around the factory. They may join your crew if they trust you to try to figure out what, uh, so try to figure out what do they care about. Some characters might not join your crew, but will offer you items to buy and sell. Automation. Some machines are automatic. These means that once active, they will work without an operator. Robots can help you automate production of blueprints. That's fantastic. In the robots panel, place the blueprint you want to automate. Then place the required materials. I love that. Thank God. Contracts are larger projects that help the neighborhood. Talk to Alcott and begin a new contract. Provide the resources and see how the neighborhood improves. Contracts can have rewards. This can be items, or this means reflects the health of the neighborhood. Neighborhood prosperity. Contracts can, re can have rewards. Rewards might be key items to expand your access to resources or symbolic item of appreciation. Some items can only be achieved by completing contracts. Okay, that's good to know. Oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> no way. Uh, teacher! Teacher? Teacher? The game just crashed. <laughs> Alright, just give me a sec as I reload it. Hang on, time out. I guess I can look up the price of this game too while I'm at it, because I didn't say that in the beginning. Price of this game is going to be... Twenty-four ninety-nine. Twenty-four ninety-nine. 
Interesting. Okay, let me bring it up here. There we are. Okay. All right. We're back. We're back. Yeah, it's on sale. Yeah. $24.99 USD, but it's on sale for 10% off right now. Right? Hopefully that saved. Oh, crap. Did it not save? Shoot, dude. Um, has an auto save here. We'll see where that takes us. Okay. I think we're at the watch that cutscene again. Oh, we have to build the bridge again and then watch the cutscene again. Just give it a sec. Okay. And what I'll do is I will save before I do that cutscene. I'll save before I do that cutscene. Yep. Okay. Leave that there. And then we will save real quick. Time out. Bam. Save. Save, please, and thank you. Look at this. I'll show you. Look, at I had my LP series going on. The last time I played this game right here was February 18th. So this is the last time I played this game was February 18th. There we go. All right, bring the son of a gun all the way back over here. Wisdom on tour. How you doing, Wisdom on tour? How's it going? Okay, we go low. We go low. We go so low. We go so low. I wonder if I could actually um, skip this. I can. Okay, let's skip this because we already saw this. Incredible Gamer. How you doing, Incredible Gamer? Okay. Again, let's kind of get rid of this thing here. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Thank you. All right. Very good. All right. There's our bridge. There's our <laughs> pathetic looking farm again. Hey, Anna Mama. How you doing, Anna Mama? Okay. Let's see here. Let's go with... I, I'm a... Look. Y'all take care of the water. Right? I don't need to take care of that. I want to go across the bridge. So I'm going across the bridge. Put my child to sleep by watching one of your Dinkum streams with her. And now I'm here. Oh, that's amazing. It's amazing. I love to hear that. Well, shout out to you. Yeah, shout out to you. It's awesome. Why, hello. Holy crap. Who are you guys? This is the guy from the beginning. Well, I say the beginning. This guy was actually over there the last time we played. Yeah, Cedric. It's already started. What started? I have been predicting this for years. What are you talking about? You being here is no coincidence, and many more will come. The system is broken. Everyone is greedy out there. Everything is crumbling down. I've been right all along, but nobody listens. What's with the, the vegetables in those bags of grain? Seeds? The answer is seeds. People cannot eat oil. When things break down, everyone will need seeds. I assume you could share some with me? Get them while they are cheap. When the collapse comes, seeds will be as good as gold. That's a point. That's a point. 
So what can we get from Cedric here? We can get canned foods. We can get potato seeds, carrot seeds, garlic seeds. Uh, more, I guess, another generator if we want another generator. Get some meat. Get some wine. Get some cooking tools. Get some corn seeds. It's corn and onion seeds along with some spices. Very well. Uh, speaking of onions, will you at least, like, make some onions for 90? Wow. I'm going to sell you some potatoes, too, if you don't mind. 540? <laughs> ho ho! Yes, yes, yes. I guess those purple things were not beets. Those were onions. That's some good money, though. Thank you, Cedric. I will uh, clear all your debris, if you don't mind. This is a, the universe. Oh, God. This is the universal stockpile again. I'm glad that it shares w throughout the world. That's good to see. I'm sorry. I need a pickaxe for that. F me. Okay. Do not have a pickaxe. I have a shovel, but I guess a shovel is not good enough. What? I haven't even, like, used the shovel. Organic waste? All this stuff, dude. Now, who are these people? These people look kind of scary. Hello? Oh, there's more people. Hello? Hello? So, you must be the others. <laughs> We've been the people that had been, like, staring them across the sinkhole for also time, and they just casually watched us build a bridge and then operated a crane and put it to, like i'm surprised they're not panicking at this point so you must be the others i guess you have met some other members of our crew madam ant farmer what is with the gas mask i met a friend of yours and he said i should ask you oh this they belong to the poor fo old folks that used to work here this is our way of sympathizing with their struggle our way well yes we are the ant farm the ant farm? You've seen what has happened to the folks in this neighborhood. Without this factory running, they all fall prey of those vultures out there. Vultures? You know what I'm talking about. Don't play dumb, girl. Excuse me? You ended You ended without a home by design. Oh, I like this. You ended without a home by design, like everyone else here. And many more will come. Someone has to do something. All right. Research complete. Oh, okay. I guess uh, Ash did that for us. Very well. Y'all look scary, but you're all not that scary with the name Ant Farm. So, like, get out of here, nerds. <laughs> there we are. All this. Let me just, like, I don't know, pick up the trash underneath your feet. Don't, don't mind me. Stockpile? Take the soil. Thank you. There's a person right over here, too. Hello. Who are you? Ruby. What is it? I'm sorry. I wasn't planning to disturb you. Well, mission failed. I'm just trying to find some materials to build a few things. Is there any way I can help you? Do I look like I need saving? I'm good on my own. So get out of my face. Hey, you don't have to be rude. We're just trying to help uh, each other out. Cold shoulder? Look, I don't know what you or your hipster friends are up to. But I'm not interested. What the heck? Okay. <laughs> what was that? Mission? A cold sh shoulder? Ruby is not friendly, but she seems to be shivering. Perhaps there's a way to befriend her. Uh, yeah. Like, I don't know. Take her gasoline and give her some warm stuff. A manual steel? What the heck is a manual steel? So we need to maybe warm her up in some degree. I will also take her other stockpile stuff. Thank you. I just robbed her. <laughs> I robbed her. Sorry, Ruby. We need pickaxes. More stuff here. Whoa! Holy crap. This is incredible. <laughs> wow. Uh, yeah, look at all these. This is a huge amount of seeds. A massive amount of seeds. I think what happens is if your inventory is full and you try to collect something, it goes straight to your stockpile. Let's test that theory out. Raw panel. I have no room for raw panel, so this should go to my stockpile. Yeah, I think it does go straight to my stockpile. I see. Okay. 
Com old computer raw soldering tools. There we go. I'm actually kind of excited now that I've opened up this new uh, side. I'm kind of interested to see where this game's going to go now. Once you cross the bridge, man, I guess possibilities are endless. A lot of gasoline. That's good to see. Re resistor. Thank you. Now, there has to be something we can do, at least, as far as, like, keeping Ruby warm or getting Ruby warm. Okay, let's go across, uh, back to our side and talk all that ish about the people we found on this side. <laughs> did we go, oh wait, did we go up there to that platform? I don't think we did, behind, uh, Cedric. Cedric, I'm gonna be selling you a lot of stuff. Just be ready, because I got a lot of food I can sell to you. What is this? Copper wire? Alpha frame blueprint? Oh! Oh, nice. Oh, that's cool. Okay, nice. Alright, great. Love that. There we go. Debris? Still need a pickaxe for that. What is this? Robot. Robotic part. Okay, robotic part. All very good stuff here. Man, there's a lot of things we're getting. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm all about it. For sure, all about it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You should set tasks for the new guy and have them build chairs for you to sell. What's going on over here? Pumping grounds? <laughs> Jackbox. Did I say jack pot? No, I said jack box. Wow. What is going on over here? Now I can build the room correctly with that alpha frame, right? Pumping grounds. We'll grab everything here. Yeah. Still. Oh, we can dig this out at least. It's gonna be 9 p.m. here in a sec. There's just some there's a guy right there we can talk to. Hey oh let's go. Why hello. How are you? Ark? I guess you are the source of all the noise. I guess so. What are you doing here? How did you cross the sinkhole? Wow, wow, wow. So many questions. Let's say I enjoy my privacy. Wait a sec. Aren't you Nikki? Uh, do I know you? I thought you looked familiar. You are Hank's daughter, right? Yes, but my father is not with us anymore. I see. I'm sorry to hear that. You and I used to play around this place when we were kids, while our parents were busy working. I guess all those folks working in this factory had a death sentence somehow. My dad also passed away years ago. They said it was the pollution in his lungs. They said the same thing about my dad. I'm afraid I don't remember much of my childhood. Everything seems a blur. You don't... What? You don't... I'm afraid I don't remember much of my childhood. Everything seems a blur. Nikki! This is the reason why we are at this factory. is because of the childhood. <laughs> The only reason why you came here was because of your childhood. That's okay. You were very young. No need to worry about this place anymore. Those oil rigs have been stopped and the vegetation has cleared the air. That's good to know. Oh my god. Alright. Sir, I'll get back to you later. It's 9pm. I gotta go back to bed. It's my bedtime apparently. God damn it. Nikki. What do you mean you don't remember your childhood? You wouldn't be coming back to the factory if it wasn't for your childhood. Right? We went from dark to bright? <laughs> at 9.30 at night? Hey, Raymond. How you doing, Raymond? 
have a good one, Raymond. I think, yeah, I think I understand that. Thank you, Raymond. Good to see you. How you doing? Raymond is a very long-time member of the channel as well. Uh, I don't know why I didn't go down to my tent. I'm an idiot. I thought my tent was up here for one reason, but it's not. Put me in there. Put me in my little, like, cellar. Everybody sleeps above me. Everybody sleeps above me. All right. $540 from Cedric, though, I tell you. I'm going to sell him a bunch of potatoes. If he wants golden potatoes, I got golden potatoes right for him. I think it's a good thing to have all this. So, like, honestly, I'm going back to now. Um, first of all, I got a lot of crap on me. So let me just put some stuff away first. I'm going to go here. We're going to go... Uh, Seeds, thank you. Uh, we will use this. Instructions made out to how to cut and weld steel beams. Uh, let me go. Uh, I feel like I got more. Wait a sec. Wait a sec. Wait a sec. I feel like I had more seeds than that. All the things that I collected, did I even really collect them? You know what I mean? Wait a sec. Is it in the other stockpile? Or is it in here? No. I will take actually some of this though. No. I want to like split this in half. No. I would like to split this in half. I need to like learn how to split this. Control click is not doing it for me. Wait a sec. Scroll down in the backpack. Oh. You son of a gun. You son of a gun. Kitten. Coming in with the clutch. Thank you, kitten. I didn't know I had this much inventory. <laughs> Holy hell. All right. There we go. Thank you for that. Appreciate that. All right. We'll put everything in here. There we go. Here we are. All right, all right. Put everything else in there. We don't need all this, right? I don't think we do. At least not right now. Okay. This. This. All this. Like, the fact that we have four bridges still, like, we don't need that stuff. Can I not put... Oh, I can't put... No, I can't. All right, I was about to say, you can't put, like... Like, what happens when we don't need all these blueprints anymore, right? Like, I don't... I don't think we're going to be building another... I, I, I highly doubt we're going to be building another bridge now. Raw clay. Yeah, we'll just leave that stuff in there for now. Let's see. Put me here. Okay, what, what, how do I use this? Maybe I need this for something? Let me use this, though. We're putting these plants down. Yep. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Back to what we were doing now. Perfect. Money maker right there. Now... One thing it doesn't seem like, it doesn't seem like these, these crops are actually being watered or getting watered. They should be watered, but they're not getting watered. So I will take it into my own hands. Control right click. Let's see. Control right click. There we go. Control right click. Thank you. I would like to sell 43 potatoes to Cedric. See how much money he gives me for that. We go there we go okay there we go build this up the backpack is kind of bug as it should have a section for the b for the blueprints but it doesn't yet oh i see okay yeah because it's like um like the, the, if you get a lot of blueprints you're gonna like kind of be overwhelmed a little bit no 
Let's go ahead and sell this, baby. Sell the potatoes. Hello, Cedric. Farmer's Market. If you help me expand my stand at the Farmer's Market, I might be able to offer you more produce. What do you say, kiddo? Okay. How much money are you asking for here, my good man? Uh... How much money are you asking for? Unless this is a contract. Let's see here. If I sell you a bunch of potatoes, like we're talking 43 potatoes, 649, it's decent. I'll take that money though. I will not buy your seeds, though. I don't need any right now. Not from you. I just need some money. Let's go talk to Mark again. Swap the shifts for Mo to farm in the morning, and he will water the stuff. Well, how come he doesn't water it when he is farming? Like, he should water it no matter what time of the day, right? Whoa. Producing farming clearing research... Likes suitcase cases, likes pianos, likes lamps, likes garlic, likes fish. His traits are he's a skilled farmer. He's resilient. That gives me no description. He's empathetic. No description. Cook, no description. Okay. Um, right. Wait a sec. He should, like, just water. No, no problem, right? Cause I'm well. I have I've ignored it really. I've ignored it. But okay, I'll switch. I'll switch them. I've been ignoring it for a couple of days, and I feel like every time I walk past, they're just not. Um, uh, they're not watered. Okay, let's do that. Uh, Rhett, I don't have you done. Let's add you to a job. Let's see here. Let's go. Um. Well, actually, let's let's look at Rhett here. Rhett seems to be an idealistic craftsman. He likes building things and believes that. Uh, what we do here have larger implications in society. So, can we click on him, too? Wait, no, no. Go back to that. Where was that thing where it showed, like, their status? Okay, there we go. Info, status, and schedule. Got it. So, info. He's a skilled builder. That's good. He likes bikes, and he likes a CNC chair with plants and beer cans, along with white bread. Okay, there we go. His trust level is not so high. This, these things need to be like a different color or something, not white. Um, he's a skilled crafter. He likes to operate in machines very naturally. He likes producing, right? And social and rebel, don't know what those do. I have no idea. Okay, so let's go schedule. I want him to produce production machines. Produce the recipe selected for the machine. If there is insufficient material in the machine, that person will try to collect them first from storage. Okay, so if we... So this could get dangerous, I feel like. <laughs> if we have him on an automatic produce, we could lose materials um, if we don't pay attention to... Like, if we don't micromanage what we want him to craft. That's how I feel how that will go. But we should have him doing this. All day. Like, that shows a motor? So I guess he's gonna make a motor? I don't know. Let's go talk to Mark. Did I save after the bridge? I don't know if I did or not, but that's a good idea. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's save with Mark's face in it, shall we? Hello, Mark. We're gonna save on top of you, Mark, if you don't mind. Have you seen those large oil pumps? I wouldn't touch them if I was you. Why is that? I thought we could get some oil for our generators. Could help us bring in some electricity to this place. Well, that sounds a, lo a lot like the old folks that used to be here. Why do you think this place ended up abandoned? It was because of an accident, no? Right, so what caused the accident? Look around. This place couldn't handle these huge machines. The earth is unstable. After the pumping started, uh, soon came the sinkholes and the explosion. I see, but we need power to make this place better. It's up to you, but remember I warned you. Here, why don't you use this pickaxe to scavenge around those larger debris? You might find something useful. Okay. If I have a pickaxe, the first thing I'm going to go and do, you already know. 
You already know what I'm. I have not used the shovel. I, well, I guess I've used the shovel and the debris. But I've hardly used the shovel. I don't think we need those in our hot bar. I don't think. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to that one room. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go um, do that. We're gonna go to the room upstairs and see what this is all about. Or this like this like fake wall or like I don't know. I'm interested though. Okay, let's see. You use the shovel. <laughs> no, you use the pickaxe, not the shovel. Blueprints. Blueprint. Blueprints. 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 Good lore. A single table. Very good. And a single bench. So a table and a bench. That's all you get. That's all you get back here is a table and a bench. Very well. Very well. All right. We also need to sell a bunch of money so we can buy a van for Mr. Uh, what's his face? Yeah, yeah. This guy, Alcott. Let's see here. So if I build these little things here, what is it? The uh, simple table, simple bench. They look the same. They do look the same. All right. Let's see here. Table. Order. Benches. Order. Benches. Order. Benches. Order. Table. Order. We'll do like that for now. Now, I don't even know what you need for this. You need two by twos. Okay, you need two by twos. We're going to have to do that. Two by twos, please. And wood. That way. Go that way. This should be enough. Well, I'll do 200. I'll do 200. We'll do 200. Okay. With that being done, <laughs> I'm assuming it needs like t like tiny little things and I, I should probably learn how to do it, right? Let's do it ourselves. So let's go. Uh, yes, the two by two, please. Oh, it's a black metal column. Oh my Lord. It's metal, not wood. Okay. All right. So that's a little bit more complicated. All right. So then let's cancel all that stuff. F it. We'll just go back to the basics. Go back to the basics. Get a table. Get a chair. You'll like it. Order that. Four by four. Order that. Four by four. Chair. There. Chair. There. Okay. That's what we'll do. I'm too tired to put stuff in the stockpile. I argue against that. 100%. You're never too tired to put stuff in your chest. Never. Okay. Go to bed. Now that we have this other, like, I'm trying to think of something that will, um, think of something that will heat up. Ruby still. I'm, I don't know. I'm not sure. There is that little uh, place I haven't bopped yet. I'm going to bop that thing. That little go through there. I think that might be like a shortcut or something to mark that like that spot right there. I need to change Rhett's job to uh, build. Oh, this is going to take forever. Oh, F that noise. Uh, right. So let's do Rhett. You, my good man, are going to build. So then Mo, don't build anymore. Just farm. And Ash... Maybe Ash? Let's see Ash. What's Ash? Ash is social skilled researcher. So the fact that we have our own research already, that's a good thing. So then what we'll do is we will get build out of there. And we will research the entire time. 
And then we will add something to the research table. That shall be good. This is missing items. I wish it told us what it was missing. That would be very helpful instead of guessing. We'll go ahead and move uh, this stuff over. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I'm going to have to build... I'm going to have to like... I think two by twos or four by fours. Sorry, four by fours. Yeah, four by fours maybe. There we go. Probably what it's missing. They need panels too. Yeah, I do wish like when it says like you need items, I do wish it kind of said something like, oh, you need you're missing this or that. Because unless the game is expecting you to like remember everything like all these blueprints and all the ingredients for the blueprints that's just absurd like oh you got to remember to have this ingredient to build this type thing do you need many tables in the beginning well this isn't going to be for us i don't think this is going to be more or less is it regular panels is it this panels it's going to be more or less for the um What is it? The uh, the selling. We're going to sell to Al Alcott? Alcott. Yeah, we're going to sell. Because we're going to try to buy a van for Alcott. But the van costs $3,500. This should be enough. So we have someone who can farm, someone who can research, someone who can build. We don't have someone that can produce yet. It does if you built one yourself. First, you s still expected to remember that after that. Wait, what? It does if you built one yourself, but you're still expected to remember after that. So it does tell you, but then you are expected to remember after that. I'm confused. <laughs> All right, so there we go. He's He's got enough materials to do his thing now. That's good. Uh, it is 1140. Are you good? You're good. Okay, he's watering. He needs uh, water jugs. Okay, good. I'll just throw all the water jugs in here, too. Blueprint we'll put here. There we go. Empty jug we'll put in there. I don't know. Maybe they'll use it. Maybe not. Maybe they have their own water jugs for all I know. If you build one yourself, it'll show you. Where does it show you if you build one yourself? Because we built the chair ourselves, right? Because that said when it's needed, right? Or when they are needed, it shows you? I don't know. I'm not going to worry about it. Got onions, though. That's good. I'm going to see how much onions go for it. Onions might go more than potatoes. Hello, Cedric. Yeah, 315. That's quite a bit. I think that's more. I think that's more value than the uh, potatoes themselves. Okay, we'll sell that. Guess we can like get this stuff out of the way too. There we are. I think someone said the childhood friend gives you something if you finish the conversation with him. Did you do that? Yes, I did. That the, It was the pickaxe. Yeah, the pickaxe. We got the pickaxe for it. There we go. All right, let's get this out of the way. So even when there's something that needs to be pickaxe, they still use the shovel animation, I guess, right? Cool. Great. Grand. I wonder how much um, area we have to work here with. We have quite a bit of area. Yeah. Okay, look it. The chair. The chair has needs an item, right? So what what does it need, right? How does it tell you what it needs? 
this is this is the thing that I'm talking about. So if there was like a blueprint here and they're like, okay, hey, you know, we need items. I wish right here the UI would say this. These are the items that you are missing. There we go. All right, Alcott, let's give you something here, buddy. Let's give it to you. Let's give it to you. Two tables, one chair. 337. It seems like a lot of resources for like that's as much as like 12 onions was worth. I feel like I'm getting robbed over here. I think the crops is where to go. Hello. Again, if I went like this and went 59, well, let's not do that. <laughs> like 29, 29 potatoes. Let's see where that takes us. Twenty nine potatoes is more than the tables and chairs that we just did. Twenty three hundred dollars now. Cool. I think farming is where it's at, baby. I guess they didn't want a second animation that was identical except for the tool we to be used. They should have at least made another animation where she was like. You know, yeah, yeah, that's uh, yeah, I know. I'm taking, I, taking food from my community. I taking food from the community because honestly, three people and like a hundred and twenty some, hundred and fifty, uh, <laughs> hundred and fifty <laughs> uh, food seems to be a little. Surplus right now. We can spread the love, Mel. Spread the love. There has to be an end to the debris at some point. Then what for resources? Can I use the uh, pickaxe on the debris? Yeah, yeah, some of the pickaxe takes debris. The stuff I'm doing right now. This takes this takes a pickaxe. I know I'm using a shovel, but before I couldn't move this stuff off. This stuff technically takes a pickaxe. I know I'm using a shovel, but this is the pickaxe right here. Because I couldn't clear this before. Until I got the pickaxe. And we already used the pickaxe. When we went up there and took out that wall. Yeah. But I am interested to see where... It takes us as far as like what we need to do for Ruby. Like she seems cold. Let's make her a jacket. No. Go. Or like make her a fire pit or make her a heater or a barrel with fires in it. I don't know. I have no idea. Okay, so that's all cleared out, right? Oh, well, there's a stockpile. That's a stockpile. We don't need that. So that's all good. Very good. Good job. How you doing over here, Ruby? Can I take this from you? <laughs> Can I take your, uh, take your, uh, tent? How's it going? Any chance you want to give us a hand? We can, uh, help each other out. Beat it, kid. You don't want to see me angry. Okay. <laughs> all right, Ruby. Fine. You, you do you, Ruby. All right, let's go back out here. We should probably have someone on the research. Oh, I should. I need to fix the research. I do. I do. I do. I do. There's so much stuff out here. Now, I think this side, right? Oh, maybe not. Okay, maybe not. Never mind. Maybe not. I thought this was going to be like the path back to our uh, area, but it isn't. All right. Hello? Water jug? Robotic part. There's another robotic part. Blue paint, or at least a paint. Like that. Thank you. Wow, look at that. That's big debris. Yeah, this is a massive. Very massive. 
we go. Super massive. And then you got food out here too, right? Yeah. Which is from our already, uh, you know, back at our main base. This is cool. Hey, Mark. I see you have a little operation going on. A few folks have similar stories to you and me. We're trying to see if we can improve our condition by fixing this place up a bit. I see. This place has attracted a lot of people. I have seen several others scattered around. I was hoping we could work together instead of everyone up for themselves, you know? Some people like myself like being alone. Some folks uh, here have a lot of baggage. I don't want any trouble. But I see your point, and I like your energy. Thanks, Mark. Oh, okay, look, I'm not much of a builder, but I can help sorting up waste. Sort up waste? Yeah, I could probably generate some nice fertile uh, oil from any organic waste you have if you build me a composting station. I see, that would be useful. It's I, it's a deal, then. Uh, get me the composting station, and I'll join your little gang. <laughs> I don't want to get any trouble, but I'll refer to your group as a little gang if you don't mind me, right? All right. Very well. We take all that. Thank you. Thank you. Man, this place is massive. Oh, more gasoline. Love that. Love that indeed. I feel like there's there was a show way back in the day. I'm trying to think of it. Uh, there was like this really cool show. Awesome show. Oh man, what is the name of it? I think it used to be on... Oh god, what would it used to be on? Might have been on Discovery. But it was a show where... They took these people. They took these people... I think it was on for like one season and then they canceled it because one of the contestants like died in the second season or something and then they stopped doing it. But they had at least one season and what happens is like they took these people and they put them in a um well the, maybe they had two seasons thinking about it. They put them in this warehouse and they say the outside world is now an apocalypse. And you must survive with the knowledge that you have throughout your life. And they picked, like, some of these people that were skilled in this or skilled in this and skilled in this. But they were put into this warehouse. And, like, everything outside was apocalyptic. And so it would be like Fallout. You know? Where you had, like, raider gangs can't come. And, like, you had to build protection for yourself. You had to, like, build your own food. You had to build your own... Uh, kind of like this kind of setting. And, like, people would come and raid your... Uh, your your base and raid your um, your warehouse during the nighttime and like you had to find ways to protect your food or you'll starve to death. Anyways, I think it was like one of the contestants in like season two or season three. She like got scared by one of the raiders it, like invading their base and like she like fell downstairs or something. I forgot the name. Oh, the colony. There it was. The colony. I think that's it. I think it was the colony. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was a really cool, like, show idea. It was pretty entertaining. But I think one of the women in it, like, fell down a flight of stairs or something, and she, I think she died, ultimately. That was a cool show. Like, if they could bring a concept back like that again, that'd be really neat. I don't know if you can watch that show anymore. Maybe on YouTube or something, somewhere has some somebody has videos somewhere or something. That was a neat thing. See again, items needed. What do I need, right? I, I mean, I obviously know what I need because I like memorize it, memorize it. But like, if it was something complicated, I'd be like, "Oh crap, what is it?" It's on Discovery Plus. Is it on there now? Do they have it up there now? I might want to rewatch that show. Maybe I'll get, like, Danielle to watch it. I watched it before I ever met Danielle. That's how, like, long ago it was. But yeah, maybe I'll, like, show Danielle it. Maybe she'll like it. I think I saw it, but maybe, maybe, maybe not before I met her. Maybe before I ever started living with her. Maybe that's what it was. Okay, that should be done. The colony, yeah. 
So I guess if you have Discovery Plus or if you want to like do a free trial for seven days of Discovery Plus, <laughs> do a free trial and check that check, check that show out because that show is pretty cool. Like honestly, I could see them doing like a Netflix thing or something. How much money do we have now? We need a thousand more dollars. Okay, let's get our research taken care of. Uh, that's just what Google says. It could be different, though. Okay, I see. Do open the tech tree. Let's do. Crafting research supply. Cooking. A okay, compost. We need composting. We can do that ourselves. I know we could let Ash do it, but we have nothing else going on for ourselves, so we can, we'll do it. It's on Prime also? Really? I'll have to rewatch that show again. I'm going to look into it after today's stream. I don't know. Like, this kind of reminded me of it, this game. We'll put that on the next docket, and I'll let Ash do that. Okay. So, to make this compost, what do we exactly need? Carpentry workbench. That would be nice. Machine workbench. Okay, yeah, these are other things we need. We need to get a machine workbench in. A lathe. I feel like we need to get this stuff in eventually. What's the compost in? What do we need for the compost? The... There's so many benches and so many things. Hello, Ash. Hi, how are you? Um. I guess, mach well, we're going to need a machine workbench eventually. I don't know what the heck we would need a concrete mixer, I guess, for concrete eventually, too. See if we can get a machine workbench in, right? That would be the next thing we, we would want. And then maybe like a carpentry workbench again, too. Machine workbench. Welding tools. Okay, so welding tools. Uh, a vice. Load all. Ah, oh, that's so handy. Load all. That's sick, dude. And then what the heck is this? 20 shaped steel pipes, which we're probably going to need the pipe bender to do that, right? Load all. Screws, wires. So screws and wires. Let's get a couple of these going. Maybe like 20, 5, 30, 30. 30 and then screws control R <gasps> what is this scrap metal we do have any scrap metal on us we don't have any scrap metal on us what the frick I have Amazon Prime can't confirm the colony does show up for Discovery Plus sick dude hey look at that damn it's too tired look at that let's go Christy Christy DM, drop in the five gifted memberships. Shout out to Christy DM and big ups, big ups to Christy D DM. That was very generous of you. Retha, Amanda, Beverly, Kayla, Chrissy, all picking up the memberships. Very, very nice of you. Thank you very much, Christy. So good. Thank you. Yes. All the love, all the love indeed. All the love indeed. Thank you, thank you. Hope you're doing well. That was very generous of you. Thank you, thank you. So we got a ton of things more need to, that need harvesting. I'm going to do this. I'm going to take these and I'm going to probably run with them. To Cedric again. I guess those are kind of bugged out too a little bit now. There we go. 
some of them show, some of them don't very well. Okay. Um, what was I doing? I needed the screws. I needed scrap metal. That's what I needed, scrap metal. Oh, that's very sweet of you, Christy. That was very kind of you to say. Thank you. Appreciate that. Control, right? Thank you. Hey, Gordon. How you doing? Let's go here. Load it up. Holy crap. That goes fast. <laughs> All right. Now, first things first. Pipe bender. Load that up. Uh, did I not pick up my screws? Load it up. Build it. I'm building the right thing, right? Pipe bender. Yeah, okay. It just the picture confuses me. Okay. Pipe bender installed. I th pipe bender. I'm just thinking like Futurama. Bender. Okay. In the pipe bender, what can you make? You can make carts, music stand, and bikes. Those two things are actually something that we need, at least for our people. People like those. Shape steel pipes is what we need also. Uh, so let's do that. We're going to need that from here. Control. There we go. 75 should be fine. Ooh, okay. This is very scarce. I don't know how many I need. I should probably check. I'm going to make 10. Okay, 10. And then... Uh, machine workbench. Load it up. Did I not pick it up? I did not. Okay. What do we need now? Wait a sec, what? You need 20 shaped. Okay, you need 20 of those. Got it. That's not right. Why did these load up like that? Okay. You need 20 of those. That's fine. And then you need that and that. Good and good. All right, we got that. 10 more. You just got finished playing Police Simulator? Oh, very good. Hope you enjoyed that. There we go. And we will take that. Just in case if I forget that it's there. And we'll load that. And we will get the welding tools and the metal tools. Right? But I feel like we have that stuff. So I'm going to check over here first. Welding and metal. Electronics. There's weld. Okay, so we do have one. Not what I wanted. No, oh, control. Right click. Okay. That's fine, I guess. Welding tools and a workstation. We might have to buy the workstation. That's fine. I could do that. Give me the workstation. Or the work table. Metal table. Metal tools. Wait. Yeah? Metal tools. Metal tools, yep. Go. Good. All right, let's do it. Here we go. Load it up. Okay, build it. And bam, we have our own machine workbench now. We're getting all the things in at least. That's good. Put that right there. What can you make with the machine workbench? Well, you can make a table saw. You can make a bandsaw, you can make a drill press, you can make a bench grinder, all these things that I have no idea. <laughs> uh, basic table saw used to create beams for construction and planters for farming. Uh, bench grinder is ideal for polishing metal pieces. Drill press is pressing holes into objects and cutting small pieces from the bandsaw. CNC machine, a computer new, uh, controlled machine, very well. Textile workbench, a sewing machine for stitching two or more layers of material together. So there's the textile workbench. Heavy machines and gas generator. Oh, so you can actually make a gas generator. That's good. That's good. 
Are you doing that for us? Thank you for doing that. I guess I can sell this chair. I could actually sell him a, a few other things. Yeah. Will you and Danielle play a two-player game in the future? Um, we actually, well, I don't know if we ever will, but we've actually, I've actually have a video or a stream, I should say. It's a live stream on the video, on the channel that I did a long time ago. I say a long time ago, might've been maybe a year ago or maybe something like that of Danielle actually playing a game here on the channel. It is the tenants. It's a tenants video. So yeah. <laughs> Um, we have Tenet's video. There's a Tenet's live stream, if you can find it on the channel, that uh, does provide her playing a game, which is kind of cool. But as far as us playing a game together, I don't know if we ever will. She's not a gamer or anything like that. She kind of likes playing games, and she, like, kind of doesn't, so it, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Give you some onions. Take that. 540. Almost 3500, right? I feel like we should beeline it to the 3500. Let's start working on this, I guess. Get back here. This is going to take a while to do, but we got to do it. So I guess this gives me, like, a chance to say hello to chat. Have a good night. Have a good day or night. Yeah, have a good one, Alex. Thanks for hanging out with us. How you doing, Becca? How's it going, Becca Ross? How you doing? Uh, 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 uh. This is going to take a while, a while. Well, there has to be something nice or cool back here, right? I think there's only one game Danielle and I have ever played together. And that was overcooked. Um, and then she'll sometimes play like Disney Dreamlight Valley or something like that. Can you not speed this up with research uh, with like the space bar? No, you can't do that. There's research that you can clear to bring you faster. Yeah. Hello to you, cans. Hello to you, game station. Definitely going there, Becca. Rolling and going and going and going. Papa was a rolling stone. Yeah, so I think if the game wants us to do anything, it wants us to maybe upgrade our uh, clear debris. This might be like, I don't know. I mean, I, I, I have no problem like sitting here and doing this, but we'll have to see. Now that we have three people in the community, the food consumption definitely uh, is is there. <laughs> but I feel like we have a lot of uh, we have a lot of food coming in, regardless. Now the water thing, I'm looking at the top there. The water, I I don't know what the water um, does or what it is for. I I don't think I've seen it gone anything lower than a hundred. We're on day 17 already? My lord. We've been here for almost a month. Almost halfway there. <laughs> almost halfway there. Tomorrow we're going to be streaming... Um, uh, Honey, I joined the cult. Uh, which I think is going to be really fun to do because I played that game before in the past and it just recently came out on 1.0 release. That's why I'm revisiting it is because it's now in full release and not in early access anymore. But Honey, I Joined the Cult is going to have a lot of fun things about it that I'm going to take a lot from chat tomorrow. Chat is going to build me a cult tomorrow. That's what we're going to do. It's going to be fun. You would think she would have at least one friend wondering where she is, right? Be like, oh, you know, the she couldn't pay the 
her the hospital bills so the house was taken away and then like you would think she would have a friend to be like oh you know you can come stay with me or like oh what happened to nikki yeah we're gonna bring a uh we're gonna we're gonna build a cult tomorrow it's gonna be fun it's a really good game if you haven't seen that game if you've never played honey i joined a cult not honey i shrunk the kids but honey i joined the cult it's a really really fun game uh, it's when I played it, there was a lot of, I was like, oh, this is going to be like simplistic, but there's some funny, good stuff, like really fun stuff to do in, in honey. I joined a cult. You'll bring the Kool-Aid. I'd be freaking there for it. Uh, what is the best channel in the discord to post a game suggestion for you? Uh, stream suggestions. Yeah. Stream suggestions. I always look at all the stuff. Yeah, stream suggestions. <laughs> We're almost done. Today a game came out that I'm very interested in. Uh, I didn't get a key for it. It was like $25, I think. twenty-five, Maybe $30, thinking about it. It was one or the other. I'll have to see. I'll have to see if I get a key for it or just have to just end up buying it for myself. But it looks really good. It does. City bus manager. Looks fun. I want to like run my own city bus uh, company. No? Can create chaos. Would I try out Story Season's Wonderful Life? Yeah, absolutely. I would. I absolutely would. Now that it's coming to PC and not just like... I, At first I was kind of bummed out because I thought it was going to be like just for uh, Nintendo Switch for console. I was like, oh, that sucks. But when they announced that it was coming to PC, I was like, oh, baby, let's go. Giddy up. I, I got excited. Oh, what did I find there? There's like a manual also. Yeah, right there. Manual, plaster, instructions. What am I supposed to do with these books? How am I supposed to use these books? Interesting. Old computer. Oh, I'm too tired? F. Look at this. This is really cool. It's like a little backyard type thing. I This, we could, I don't know. <laughs> we could like, can I get rid of that tree? That's kind of in inconvenient right there. You can make something back here. Like you could put like houses back here. I like that. Yeah, $30. That's what it is. $30. It's, uh, it's a hefty price for a management game. It better be freaking good. That's all I'm saying. Hey, Molly. How you doing, Molly Joe Snow? What's going on, Molly Joe Snow? Was watching your My Time at Sandrock series on YouTube when I saw you were live. This game looks neat. Well, hello, Molly. How you doing? Thank you for checking out Sandrock. Hope you're enjoying that series. Appreciate that. Can you color the buses daft or obnoxious colors? Oh, you must be talking about the bus game, yeah? Holy crap, look at all that good stuff. Hell yeah. Please and thank you. Oh, blueprints too. Alpha balcony. Balcony? Hanging balcony. Hanging balcony. And a robotic part. This is definitely an area I would like to build like houses back or like one maybe gigantic house that'd be kind of fun but this what the hell am i supposed to do with the trees in the way and i get rid of the trees because i would like i would love to put like um i would love to put like a giant building with like a bunch of rooms and stuff i think that'd be kind of cool No, I wouldn't be driving the bus. No, <laughs> luckily I wouldn't be driving the bus. I would be uh, managing the bus routes for the most part. <laughs> let's see. Let's see. Um. Okay. Time out. Let me grab those uh, those fruits of labor. I'll put this in here though. Nope. 
I'm like more about like doing the onions. I could actually, if I wanted to, start making more. Unless they're out of seeds. I don't know if they're out of seeds or not. They should be fine on seeds. I, I, I could make more. More planter boxes. They got corn seeds, carrot seeds left, garlic seeds still going. Almost at 3,500. Um, let's grab this. Yeah, there we go. Let's make more of these, shall we? Shall we? I don't know how much space I want in between. You like that? Hey, worms. <laughs> Research completed. We've got worms. There we go. Having more of these, I think is a good way. I don't think I'm going to go all the way down with it, though. Excuse me. There we go. There you go. Look at him. He's already building. Good for him. I'm not going to go all the way down. But I'll get more of these in. There we are. That's good. We put these columns away too. Oh crap. We need, uh, we need uh, energy. We ran out of fuel. Alright. Let's see here. I got 29 fuel, my lord. Give me that. Give me that. Thank you. We'll put away a few things. Uh, organic waste. Uh, this. This. All this stuff. It's gonna get, like, really hectic, isn't it? When, like, you get a bunch of things. How are you gonna, like... You're gonna have to, like, hope that you can sort things. Like, filter things. There we are. Not really sure what to do with the books still, but I'll leave them in my pockets. I don't know how I feel about putting the wood in there. Sandpaper. No. Okay. So now that she's done doing that, we could can we like switch her doing something else? In use. Hey, Ash. I have a feeling if we are going to build this place up, we will need different kinds of machines. It seems that the table saw I brought has been really useful, no? It seems that's what I mean. Uh, we have been stuck without the right equipment. But buying machines from the market would be impossible. You managed to build the planner, right? Could you show me how to help uh, build machines? You want to build machines yourself? Why not? No offense, but I thought you would just like giving no orders. Well, maybe that was me at some point, but I want to leave that behind. Show me how to do what you do. Okay, I will. We should build a machine workbench, a place where we can we can use to build machines on it. Okay, done it. <laughs> Way ahead of you. Right? Right. Right. <laughs> Managing waste. Build and install a compost station. So wait, we can talk to her again, right? That's it. We did it. Nice work. The machine workbench will be really useful. I hope so. I would like to spend some time learning how this all works. Uh, is there areas of research that I should be looking into? Well, if you want to build machines, I guess you should study engineering. From housewife to squatter to engineering. I like that. Housewife? Long story. I'll share it with you at some point. Right now, I have some books to read. A career path. A new mission. I'm interested. Research Engineering 101. Engineering 101, yeah? Skills? Research? Bargaining. Learn how to negotiate and get a better price. Oh, I love that. 101. Programming 101. Sorry, Programming 01. Materials Plaster. Ah, I see the books open up. I think the books open up all these different things for us. I see. Okay, so Engineering 101. There we go. Can we do this for the rest of the day? Or, yeah, we'll do this for the rest of the day. Help out on that. Heck yeah. 
All right, I get it. Oh crap, we need uh, well, we need energy. We'll do the energy. Don't worry about it. We'll get that. Is there a cooking side to this? Uh, if you mean can you cook in this game? Yes, there, you'll be able to make a cooking table, I believe. Is there seasons in this game? I don't think so. No. The broad uh, collection of books they've got there. Can you use the pick or shovel on the trees? No, it doesn't seem like it. Can't I can't click anything on the trees. And that's like to put it in my hot bar, which I don't think I have to, right? Check out a look at a game. A YouTube AR is making the channel is called Pixel Architect. Pixel Architect. Okay. Never heard of Pixel Architect before. Did I make the compost bin yet? I don't think so. <laughs> Only because um, I don't have the right stuff or the right thing to make it yet, I don't think. We are? Okay. All right. We're going to need more wood, too. Potatoes. Potatoes. How y'all doing in here? I mean, I could give you some onions. Uh, let's go control. 24 onions. We'll sell uh, half of the other onions to Cedric real quick. And then hopefully we'll get this engineering 101 done. Hello, Cedric. Let's go here and give you this. 360. Where does that put us? 3,100. Almost to 3,500. Very, very close indeed. Okay. So that research should be getting done soon. Good. This. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Building the compost out. Let's go through some of these machines again. Oh, it needs power. Yep. Still need to do that. Repair this. Okay. Good. Let's see. Nope. These are like next tier level stuff. I'm like kind of terrified to get into. Carpenter, I want to get a carpentry workbench. That would be nice. And then I think here we've built everything except for like the lathe, the chop saw, and the concrete mixer. Here we, I would like to get a hot tub. That'd be cool. A uh, beer maturing station would be neat. And then a wooden crate also. Uh, but we need some of this stuff. Here we go. Wouldn't it be fun if you were able to make a treehouse? I know, right? Make a treehouse that she talks about all the time. Put the treehouse in the back. Baked potato sounds really good right now. Now, give me some baked potatoes. Oh, shoot. I didn't want to collect all. No, I wanted to leave this in there. I hate that this chest is, like, right up here. Okay, good. We researched it. Uh, new career path has been completed. Ash? Research completed for Engineering 101. Good. The interesting thing about reading a book is that it points to several other books to read. Feels like a never-ending cycle. True, but it is good to put things in practice. Otherwise, you might forget everything. If you don't mind, Nikki... I think I would like to study some more. I feel like I'm getting the hang of this. You are the boss. Let me know if you discover any interesting project where I can test my skills. Very well. That was that. So wait a sec. Uh, okay. Right. Anybody over here have anything to talk about? So, Rhett, how come you ended up here? You look like someone who could get a fancy job out there. Uh, so do you with those skills. I guess I could. I guess I was never planning to stay until I saw what was going on here. In my case, it was more as a form of protest. My family lives in this gated community with 24-7 security, afraid of everything that is going on in the world. I got tired of arguing with my father about how he can 
how can we make a difference? So I decided to come here. I haven't talked to them since. It sounds like a drastic change. You don't miss them? I try not to think about them. I need to prove to them there is uh, some purpose here, you know? Something more than just earning money by exploiting people around you. I guess. I'm looking for that too. Huh. I was wondering, Rhett. I know it might be a big question. What are your thoughts on the purpose of the common? I was hoping you would participate in defining that, as well as anyone else that decides to join us. I see that, but what is your motivation? What makes you tick? I'll tell you what, I got really excited when I saw uh, that table saw you brought. <laughs> I could use, I could see all the potential of the things that we could build. I like woodworking, but more specifically, I like getting uh, better and better at something simple, you know, to the point in which it becomes precious. You're talking about uh, perfecting your craftsmanship? I guess you could put it like that. In my experience, the only way to get better practice, you no, know, is is doing more, right? You do more, you get better. Yes. Yes, and also learning to improve your tools. I wish we would have a dedicated carpentry workbench. Somewhere we can try new ideas. I saw on this book on carpentry. I like that a lot. There we go. I'll see what I can do. There we are. Very cool. Yeah, I can't set a new research until she gets up. Yeah, it won't let me. Okay. Uh, so, a book on advanced carpentry. Nice. Wait a sec. There you go. Okay, she's gone. Finally. Okay, let's see here. The CAD. Creation of custom blueprints for room-sized objects. Technical drawing. That unlocked the foundations of engineering. Pretty cool. Advanced carpentries right here. 20 hours to do that. F. 20 hours? My lord. <laughs> yeah. You can, you do it in, in that, in your own panel. You do it in your own panel. Wait a sec. See, this is the thing. The game doesn't teach you this. The game doesn't teach you that you can do it in your own panel. Thank you. Is that a sewage or a wash closet? Anything to do with pipes? <laughs> Hey, Peter, how you doing, Peter? Is it as bad as people are saying? Uh, well, I don't know. I mean, we played this game on the channel before. I'm pretty sure you were around uh, when we played it last, but... What the frick just Hi. happened? Hello. Uh, I... How are you? Oh, my... Oh, my God, I broke your chair. You broke my chair? We have someone that just came and disturbed the colony. The colony. The common hood. What are you doing to me? <laughs> Did you see that? That scared the crap out of me. Lord. I gotta like, dress my stuff again. There we are. Ah. He comes in at, at, a, at a at a hot time, no? All right. So I guess we just got to wait for that research gun. Let's go ahead and talk to... Who, where, where's the other one? We talked to Ash. We talked to Red. Let's talk to Mo. Where's Mo? Oh, it's nighttime? Oh, shoot. I didn't realize it was like 10 p.m. No coffee and donut this time? Frick, dude. Don't even get me started. That sounds good. What is she making? Okay, people think you're dressed up to no, cook. Not She's not dressed up to cook. <laughs> She's dressed up to cut hair. <laughs> oh, she's dressed up to cut hair and dressed up to uh, raid my wallet is what she also did. She just took my card out of my wallet. Very well. Oh, that's right. You come here, you take my card, and you leave the house. Got it. All right. Have a good day or a good rest of your day. All right.
You like that? Thank you. Bye. There we are. There we are. There we are. Oh, look. There's the carrots. Oh, very good. Don't touch the carrot. My carrot. Okay. Actually, I'm not going to put... Well, time out. I will. I'll put it. Carrot goes here. Carrot goes here. Onions and carrots, baby. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll give them some carrots. I'm going to sell this, though. Yeah. Did you ever find out what was in the donut you hated the strange taste of? Um. What? Um. Well, I do. I, there, there's types of donuts I don't like. Yeah. That's 3500 by the way. I don't like the jelly-filled donuts, and I don't like donuts that filled with custard. I, I don't like those. Those are not good donuts. <laughs> oh, Alcott? Flea market. I can sell items if you make your Bible, right? I'll take anything you make out of raw wood on the saw table, right? If you build stuff from blueprints, I sure can get a good price. I wish I could offer you more things, but I don't have a good way of moving around. If you can help me acquire a van, I can expand the available items in the shop. I'll set up a contract. Okay, so we, we will do the co contract. Yeah, we got the contract. Buy a van. Yes. I see. Farmer's Market. That's for uh, Cedric. So we'll do the van because it costs more. We will. Uh... Oh, God. How do I do this? Can I just like. How do I do this? This is weird. Can I just like type in my own number? Do I have to sit here and like hit this button? Time out. Try it again. I'm confused on that. Submit. A hundred dollars. My lord. Good? Good. Complete. Hooray! <laughs> we bought the van. <laughs> oh, God. There we go. I don't have to worry about harvesting. Harvesting is done automatically by me or by them, but I, I do it from time to time. Um, so we got the we got the uh, car, man. The van has been great for uh, accessing more wares. Well worth the cost. Buy a truck. Wait, now you have another thing for us? Why do you want us to buy a truck? Okay, so this upgraded a few things. Um, I guess it gave us more materials here that we can buy at an instant now. Good. Good job. Contract. Buy a truck. Help Alcott acquire a truck to increase your purchasing options. $20,000? Oh my lord. Alright. Well then. We'll do the rest of the advanced carpentry for the afternoon on the research there. Boston cream donuts. I've never heard of Boston cream donuts. There's a local donut shop that puts bacon on chocolate cake donut with fudge icing. It's amazing. Oh, was there a load all button for the uh, money? That definitely would have made it quicker. Now you can buy all the resources that would have uh, ben oh, benefits that would have been benefit. Is that what, what you're saying? Benefit that would have been benefit or been infinite. <laughs> Which one? I see a couple ones there. Ben nothing or Ben infinite. <laughs> Do this again. Wow, a lot of a lot of this is ready to harvest. Okay, check here. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. Boom, boom. Take the twenty. 
leave it uh, as a tip. Okay, 20 carats will sell. Oh, would have been infinite. Oh, I see. Okay. Would have run out infinite? Infinite is the opposite of infinite? Oh, my lord. Come on. Like, break it down here, people. <laughs> like, would have been finite. I don't think I've ever heard anybody use finite in a sentence before. The opposite of infinite. Got it. <laughs> He's a wheeze. Oy, oy, oy. 300. All right. Let's see. Research. Um... Now, how do I know which one is being done now? Like, I know the advanced carpentry is doing, but if if I didn't know, like if I forgot, you know, oh, I didn't know advanced carpentry was doing its thing, right? How would I know? I guess you wouldn't know. It's pronounced finite, finite. Oh my God, infinite is pronounced finite. F all of that noise. Honestly, don't even at me. F all that noise. Is this actually the same pro? Yeah, that is the same uh, long progress as the one before. I'm English. What can I say? <laughs> you can speak English. <laughs> that is basically. Finite. So infinite is pronounced finite? I don't believe you guys. Y'all are weird. <laughs> Y'all are weird. Come on. I don't agree. Where my lexicon? Thanks, note. Uh, Nick, we'll take that, uh, take that note. <laughs> Live chat is the best, is best when is one trying to learn English. <laughs> There we go. Oh, there's a stockpile out here. I didn't know there was a stockpile out here, too. I didn't see that before. It's good to know now. This, take all that. Ooh, what is that? Farming tools. <laughs> aluminum? Is it aluminum or is it aluminium? <laughs> Aluminum or aluminium? See, pronunciations of words is garbage. No such thing as correct pronunciations. I know there's people that say aluminum, and I know there's people that say aluminium. Garbage! It's absolute garbage, I'm telling you. Infinite is not pronounced finite. Finite is. Finite is a word. It means limited. Finite. Yeah, I know finite is a word. That's what we're talking about. If I face palm as hard as I want to, I would be elbow deep in my own head. Is it color or is it color? Facts, dude. Facts. Color or color? Color, or what's the other pronunciation of color? 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 I don't even know, dude. That's a, that's a, that's a big one. I'm not doing that one. It's all hot, it's all hot garbage. That's all it is. Mm -mm. Yeah, infinite and finite are different words. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. We're talking about how they're different words. There we go. I want it to say infinite now. <laughs> infinite. Infinite. Have you ever had infinite money? No. Danielle took my card. She thinks she has infinite money. 
until I called a credit card company and said my wife stole my credit card. And we don't have infinite money. Now, do we? Simple staircase. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at that. Simple step. That's cool, too. Nice. I want that couch. Color, color, pronounced the same. Are you sure? I've heard them pronounced differently. But again, pronunciations are garbage. They don't mean anything. They're spelt differently, but they are. You're so so. You're telling me something is spelled differently, but also has the same pronunciation. I say bullshit. <laughs> Ooh, more blueprints. Alpha planter. Ah, look at that double planter box. That's pretty cool. The American who wrote their dictionary took the U on most words like vigor, honor, etc. Who wrote the dictionary? Is there like an actual person that wrote the dictionary? There has to be, right? Because <laughs> it's the dictionary. It didn't just spring out of freaking water. Right, 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 right. Facts. There you go. That's better. Webster, Noah Webster. He wrote the dictionary. We need it. Does he have a Twitter account? Do we need to tweet at him? And say, sir, you need to politely F off. Do you know the definition of that? Ask him that. Damn it, there is metal tools here. I didn't have to buy it. Crap, man. I have had it this whole time. Oh, there's another stockpile over here. Silent useless, useless letters. Exactly. No and no. John Dix Dictionary wrote the dictionary. Now you're after with me, right? Nineteen, the seventeen hundreds. There was a guy who wrote the English dictionary. Should we be yelling at the people? You know all those common words. I, you know, you see it a lot. Where it's like some of the weirdest words, like today, that you've never heard of or never used as sentence, were like the most popular words that were ever back in like the eighteen hundreds. Like, how come words just like eventually fall out of vocabulary, fall out of like, like fall out of like everyday use? And then we, well, I guess, I guess, I don't know. People make up their own words, though. Like slang, you know slang. And when someone talks slang, you know what they're talking about. You know. You don't believe there was a guy named John Dictionary? I don't believe that. That seems too basic. Just like how I don't believe there's someone named Jefferson. That's too proper. Nobody is named Jefferson nowadays. Evolution? Evolution is why? So we evolved out of our own words? Is that what it is? So like, a hundred years from now, are we gonna evolve out of these words?
Love the staircase, though. I'm a big fan of the staircase. Okay, so I think she finished it, right? She should have finished it, right? She didn't finish it! My god. Okay. Advanced carpentry done. Fantastic. Which one was that under? This one? Yes. I want this. Load all. Everything but the glue. We need glue. Words are constantly evolving, so is language. That's why I think pronunciations are garbage. I think the word pronunciation can uh, drop out of English language. <laughs> <laughs> Samuel Johnson's A Dictionary of the English Language of 1755. There's an argument about global communication like newspaper. Uh, newspaper helped to stabilize some uh, lingual shift. Who invented like was it the fin was it the Finnish Finnish? Aren't they the ones that invented the alphabet? The Phoenicia aren't they the ones that invented the alphabet? So if it wasn't for them, we'd be all screwed. <laughs> That's how they were able to do trades like back then, right? They could do trading once they learned a like universal communication tool of some sort. That's a lot of food. I'm going to save these 24 carrots. I'm going to sell them. Why not? We evolved out of the saying V and thou. It's facts. V and thou. I guess you're right. Because if you like uh, read old literature. I mean, you read the, um, you know, f just example. Uh, the uh, Constitution. The words in there and the sentences in there. We're like, what the frick were these guys on? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck were they talking about? The way they worded that, and they made that so complicated. I believe future language will use shorter word that mean many things depending on how you put it together. Like finish. Either that or it will be all electronic. Have you ever seen... Has anybody ever seen the... Um, Oh, I need the glue. Has anybody ever seen the augmented uh, reality glasses that they have they're, that they're selling right now? What if we wear these augmented glasses? Look up the Amazon augmented glasses. Those things are pretty sick. You wear sunglasses and you can do everything on your phone. And you can watch YouTube. It's freaking crazy. Cool as hell. I wanted the glue, baby. I wanted the glue. Glue, glue. There's the glue. <clears throat> Phoenician alphabet. Yeah, the Phoenicians. There you go. The Phoenicians alphabet. That was the ones that started the alphabet. Phoenician. You can thank the Phoenicians. 200 screws? Oh my lord. Alright, well... Uh, collect all. We're gonna need 200 screws. I gotta get some scrap metal. Where is it? There it is. Perfect. Oh, I have scrap metal on me. I have it. It's right there. I have enough. Like the Google Glasses, but more. I haven't seen the Google Glasses. There we go. Okay. Advanced carpentry now. Coming in. Load it up. There we go. Pop up ads with the glasses. Might cause problems. <laughs> oh my lord. Put that like 
This is going to get very, very tight. This is a big son of a gun. Hooray! Carpentry. We did it. Now I believe we can make, yes, the compost station now. Load it up. We are missing tools. Wood tools and wood glue. Did I not get enough glue or did I use all my glue? You have tools and uh, glue. You do. You do, you do. I want glue and I want... 210? Alright. I think I just need one of each, please. I could have swore I just bought the freaking glue. Did I not buy the glue? Bye. There we go. And then 200 screws. Select. Oh, oh yeah, that's why because all that stuff was in there. I didn't collect them all. Damn it! I need again, such a such a freaking thing. I, any other crafting game I've ever played, I've never had to like remember to pick my stuff up off of off of the table. Such a thing to get used to. Collect all. Okay. Send it. Load it up. Build it. Good. Great job. Collect all. Thank you. What else can we build here? Tinker station. Craft and repair any delicate and smaller scaled items here. Potting station. The beehive. Sold. A generic workbench. Not sold. Okay, so we'll put that compost thing like with that guy though. Right? That's what we want to do. Tell him that we built it. We went from hieroglyphs, glyphics to uh, written words and now emojis. Language is actually devolving back to hieroglyphics. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know who you talk to with emojis, but I'm interested to know what conversation that is like. I assume there's a lot of eggplants involved, a lot of peaches, and a lot of googly eyes. <laughs> I see you have been quite busy. Yes, this place has so much to offer. I have so many ideas. Sounds good. Let me know when you have the composting ready in order. Uh, okay, so you want me to put it down? I want to put it down by you. Because I know you're going to make good use of it out here. Right? That's what I want to do. I want to put it out here with you. Ah! Composting bin. Rotate. There we go. Because he has his stock thing right here, right? And so anything he can grab, he can grab all this organic waste and do that. Yeah. <laughs> Someone asked uh, for a composting station. Ah, you did it. Yeah. Well, uh, so uh, you would like to join us, Mark. We could really use your help. Okay, okay. As long as I can maintain some privacy. I'm sure we can figure out that. This place is huge. I guess so. Character joined. Mark. So Mark joined the colony, so to speak. The hood. Welcome to the hood. Um, in that case, it's going to be easy to just go community, talk to Mark. It says Mark grew up in a neighborhood near the factory. After his parents passed away, he ended up on the streets. He's been trying to get by with bare minimum. Um, right. So he has no... Okay, he does. He has a recycler, which I don't know what that means because it doesn't show the stats for it. The maker doesn't show and master excavator. He likes guitars, music stands, plants hanging. He loves potatoes and grilled vegetables. Good. So your job, Mark, is going to be... Um, produce... Is that what we need him to do? Or is it farm? Or is it clear? Produce. Would that be his... Uh, would that be him doing the compost? Produce? I think so. Have him clear the debris instead? We'll do that. Okay, we'll save. Quickly save.
It's a game called Kinseed. It was worked on by former Fable developers by Lionhead Studios. Old Lionhead Studios, yeah? Hey, Charlie, how you doing? Good day to you. Good thing he likes potatoes right now, I know, right? So now that we got the compost bin started and done, um, let's talk to Mo. So, what do we do next? Uh, do you think we can scale up this operation? Well, having more food would be nice, but you need to consider the diversity of the crops. I would go for different species. You're right. We might be able to mix them up into different recipes. Uh, why don't we try farming carrots, onions, and corn for now? Let's aim to have at least four crops of each. What do you think? Sounds good. Let's do it. So, I have everything. The only thing I just don't have is corn. Right? I don't think I have corn. I don't know. Do I have corn seeds? I might have corn seeds. It's getting really busy back here now. I do have corn seeds. Yes, sons of guns. It's just going to be a while before the corn seeds come out. Excuse me. Pardon me. I'm interested in doing this, though. The alpha planter. Yeah, the alpha planter. I want to build a, a house back there for all of them. That's a big planter box. That's a massive planting box. Put it over here. Soil, a 4x4 four four column, and a 4x4 four four beam. Okay. Whoops. 4x4 four four column and a 4x4 four four beam. Okay. Or 4x8 column. Or 4x4 four four column and a 4x8 beam. Okay. Do this. So producing is the thing that does compost? Is that what does is that what producing does? Article said formal fable in Stardew Valley dev? Wait, what? Former Stardew Valley dev? Hasn't there always been one dev for the Stardew Valley though? Read it wrong, it said former Fable dev, Stardew Valley like RPG. Oh, I see, okay. I see. So a former dev from Lionhead Studios, I would assume. I don't know, it depends. Which Fable, which Fable they're talking about. <laughs> which dev team, which Fable team, like, hang on a sec now. <laughs> Let's build this bad boy. It looks like it could be bigger. Maybe offer more. Wait, what the frick? Oh, I put the soil in first? Whoa. I was not expecting that. Why would I put the soil in first? Alright. Regardless, it's fine. Oh, damn it. There would be no reason for me to put the soil in first. There we go. There we are. Uh, oh, do I not have enough beams? I need more. Oh, damn it. See, this is why. This, uh... Ah. I just... Oh, and I'm tired. Dang it! Ah! Nah, shake the screen! Out of anger! That's why I wish I knew how much exactly I needed for that. Concerned Ape does have their new, uh, new help now. Probably since after 1.0 release, right? I mean, they have to have their own help now if they're making, uh... It, well, surprisingly, they're, you know, continuing with... Stardew Valley updates and things like that, and then working on Haunted Chocolatier for God knows how long now. There we go. Ooh, 
baby. Everybody's motivated. Everybody's cold. One thing that it doesn't, like, the game hasn't taught me yet, <clears throat> at least, or hasn't even, like, suggested, is, like, oh, you know, like, why don't we talk about, you know, keeping people warm, you know? That you think would be, like, the first thing we would do. Oh, yeah, let's keep people warm, shall we? Yeah, I think we should. I think we should keep people warm. I think it would be very important. Cooking, basic cooking. This probably could do this. It'd be easy. Worms, let's do that. Let's do cooking. It's an easy one. Did I find out how to make a hot tub? Uh, no. No, not yet. That's probably later. Later in the game. Oh, I need more. Let's do it. Let's do it. I need more of this, right? Guess I didn't have enough. That's a lot. That's a lot, a lot. I heard a few years ago they had been thinking of a magic of a magic academy ideal. And I guess evolved into a chocolate making somehow. <laughs> I'm about it. I'm about the chocolate factory. I'm for it. I'm ready for it. I want it. I want to see it. I'm interested. Everybody knows. Right? No secret there. <laughs> Absolutely no secret. I'm going to make a hundred more, I guess. Just to make sure I have enough. One more. Thank you. There we go. All right. Can we finally, like, continue this? Like, the one thing I wish, though, is I wish you could continue this, but you can't continue the blueprint. It just is... What the frick? Oh, they... Uh, no. This is not correct. That's really frustrating. <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. All right. Pack it up. Pack it all up. Again, I don't know why the soil acted that way, but it did. Right, okay. Um, I guess I could do it myself. That's one way. I really wanted to. This is what I wanted to build. Again, what the frick? I think that's backwards. I think there's something wrong with this blueprint. I don't think you're supposed to do that first, but it has you do it first. There we go. Ah. No! Don't plant right away! Time out! Hang on! Wait till I'm done! What are you doing? You see me building? You see me building? Obviously. There we go. I'm not ready for the soil. My lord. You do plant corn right in front of my face? There we go. What the hell am I making? There we go. That's what it's supposed to look like. Uh, that's what it's supposed to look like. All right. So I can't do anything about this. I can't even, like, take the soil back. Not until it's done, I guess. But that's what it's supposed to look like. There. You happy about the corn? Put the corn in. I hope that doesn't delete the corn every time. Because then we wasted, like, a few corn seeds. Right? Hot Tub Time Machine? That's a funny movie. Okay? Hot Tub Time Machine is a funny movie. I wanted to see that. I mean, I do like that planter box, but my lord. Was that worth the struggle there? Who freaking knows? This obviously is like, like, this needs to get out of here. This doesn't need to be here. These trees. I would love to do something here, but those trees are just like kind of in a, in a very cock blocky way. 
All right. Let me see if I can build something big ish. But, uh, really, let's see if I can build a um. Yeah. A floor. Wait a sec. I might have a good blueprint for this. Um, I want to see if I can build a house or a building back there. That's what I really, really want to do. Let's go to the stockpile. Didn't they make a sequel to it? I think they did, yeah. I think there was a sequel to the movie. Where did all my blueprints go? This isn't all my blueprints, is it? There it is. Okay, that's what I'm looking for. Maybe this is all my blueprints, but I'm looking for this. I'm looking for the, um, the alpha frame. So how do you build an alpha frame? What do you need for this? Probably something I don't even know yet, right? Let's see. Columns. Okay, yeah, no, we could do this. Yeah, we could do this. I'm thinking we go alpha frame out here. Right there. Hopefully I have enough. You better hope I have enough. That's all I got to say. Enough ingredients, no? Okay, this way. There we go. I, my, my like, thought process is I'm, like, trying to, like... Come on now. I want to build, like, a uh, two-story building over here. And I want them to live here. In peace. <laughs> in peace and harmony. This building kind of also reminds me of that one movie. What was that one movie? I think Justin Long. Is that his name? Justin Long. Jonah Hill. Uh, they like turn that college into, or they turn the, they turn this like abandoned psych ward into a college. Yes, accepted. Thank you. That's what it was. Hey, look at that. So now that we have an alpha frame in, what did we do? Do we use four by eight frame on that, or was that a um? Four by four. That might have been four by four, right? Yeah, four by four. Four. Accepted. That's a good movie too. I like Accepted. That's a funny movie. Now we should have some walls that we can use just to kind of get an idea what this will look like. Actually, I don't think a alpha frame is a good idea in this case. I really don't think it is. Now thinking about it. Let's see. Oh, man. This is hard to be creative in. Um, let's get the wall. I'll get the wall. Uh, we'll get the panels, I guess. Panels. Columns. Okay. All right. Well, we'll see. We'll see here. We'll see how this looks. This, now thinking about this, I don't know if this is how I want this to look. Yeah. Now, it would be perfect for the ceiling, but this is not exactly what I was imagining now thinking about it. We want to go... Uh, we want to go floor. Do I not have the floor on me? No, I do. We want to go floor. Simple floor. There we go. Simple floor. Okay, you know what? Cancel that. Because I don't want it on the line. I want it precisely... Not on the line. Like, right there, I guess. Right, 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 right there. Perfect. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. Now, easy enough, we could just add this as an order and people can build it for us. Oh my god. People can build it for us, which we probably will do. But I want to get it started here. Go across. Boom. Okay. Great. Now, what I want is I want this to come to order. And I want it to expand out here. Okay. 
expand out here. Okay. Very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come out this way. Very good. All right. Very good. Okay. That will be good. And then let's do a whole nother row right here. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, we'll do that. That's going to take a while. This is going to be like the start of like moving these people out of a tent and into here, I think, right? Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Are these houses? This is going to be like a giant house. I'm going to try to make like a giant house for these people. The only thing is about this is that <laughs> this entire time we have not learned to build a door and I don't know if there will be doors in this game, but this entire time we have no doors. Um, in real life, you probably wouldn't want to build where I'm building. You probably would want to build with inside a structure already just because weather and all that. But we're putting it outside because that's how I like it. You probably would put the crops outside instead, but I like the outside for the people. Gives them a morale boost. Um, let's do the walls. No, we don't need to do that. We need to build the walls, actually. Actually, that's fine. They have the walls. Give off the panels. The alpha frame in there. Four columns. That, that, that. They should be okay to do that in the morrow. It's almost 9 p.m. right now. I'll jump on this real quick. Cooking's done. That's good to see. Uh, preserve foods, I guess, is the next thing we can do. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, you're not very insulated at all. <laughs> Which is funny, because this game still hasn't taught us how, how about how to... Uh, like keep our people warm but look at that there's mark marks with us now that's cool to see i might not have noticed that before that's nice there's like two chairs in the back it seems like there you could find two more people to join your colony as well you put nine floors blueprints just well okay so i know that i've only put these blueprints i'm saving the nine actual ones Unless they use it. I hope the god they don't use it. But I am saving the other the other already made ones for over here. So I was hoping that they would build this for when I'm starting to build over here. Because these trees are gonna be like kind of They're not they're gonna be in the way. So I hope they don't use those ones, the floors that are already made. We'll have to see, but um yeah. I want to put something over here too. And maybe have like two separate buildings. And then, like, some trees in the middle here. Well, I said these trees are going to be in the middle. And then maybe have something outside here. I was thinking about doing uh, another row. But I'm not going to do another row. I'll just leave it how it is. And then I'll build something over here with the, that, too. Let's see. Are you going to use what I already had? I want you to use the materials. That's all I want you to do. I don't want you to use the things that are already made. Oh, look at you. All right. Well, very well. That's good. wonder if the trees will automatically go away if you build there. That's a good... Uh, you know, I don't know. That's a good question. I'll have to see. Okay, let's go over to Cedric. Oh, uh, well, I don't really have anything for Cedric. Did you find the valve for the potting station? I can't find one. Uh, pff, Rick. I don't even know. I don't even know what the potting... I mean, I, I, I think we unlocked the potting station, right? Somewhere. I don't know what workbench it is. I think, right? Maybe, I don't know. I just know we did research and I think we got a potting station. Ah, right here. Potting station. Yeah, so I don't know. 
Uh, it looks like this you're looking for, the valve, that. Uh, shoot, let's see. Do I have a valve? Even if I do have a valve, I will not know how I found it. Do I have a valve? I do not. But I'm guessing uh, is you probably will get a valve or have an, a, the ability to buy a valve. Not a valve, a valve. If you upgrade and buy uh, the truck for Alcott, maybe. You buy the van for Alcott, which we've already done, but then you spend $20,000 to buy the truck for Alcott. Maybe that will give us uh, an option to buy a valve. Yeah, I'm not sure. Did you do this? Alpha floor made. Okay, so you made it, I think, for based off of the materials that you had, right? Should have been like that. That's how I wanted it to go. Now, for this... I don't know if I can, like, precisely put it down exactly the same on the other side, but we'll see. We'll see if I can. If it will look somewhat similar, let's see. Uh, where's the corner on that? Right there. Okay, we'll see if I can do it or not. I don't know. Yeah, I think that's pretty pretty damn close. Question is, how close can we get to the tree? Just like that, right? Yeah. Still thinking uh, two-story houses here, though. There we go. Work around the trees, baby. Work around the trees. Okay. These are good. So I'm glad that they didn't have to use that pre uh, prefab or pre-made already. And then we can put up the walls here, which I think we have maybe a couple walls already. But we want to put up a couple walls. The bad thing about all this is that I don't know which direction is the right direction. I guess that's it. To order. We'll have to figure that out when they build it. But I don't know which directions, like inside or outside. Like that. And then we will go like this. Perfect. And kind of like go down, right? And go throughout and around. Right. That's the idea. Oh, yeah, that would look pretty cool. So, like, what you could do is you could do, like, a like a two-story right here, right? And then what you could do on this side and this side, you could have the, the hanging balcony. You could have the hanging balcony going to, towards the trees or thing, you know, something like that. That'd be kind of cool. Have a good night, Gordon. Have a good rest of your night. All right, let's see. Now, let's see. We go like this. Order. Takes a lot of patience to play this game. I tell you what. If you don't have patience, this might not be the game for you. <laughs> like this. There we go. I really hope those are going in the right way. Like I said, it doesn't matter. If they don't go in the right way, then I'll pick them up and put them in the right way. Like, it's hard to see that little lip there. There we go. I guess I can only assume. there perfect and oh i guess over time this will just be built you know unless we help them which i guess we could you know there we go Um, 
right there. Okay, last one. Right there. Good. And then we'll fill in the gaps. I just realized that I just made a... Um, I, I have no door. Uh, so this, that's a door. <laughs> this is a door instead. How about that? Yep. And then um, we can build, like, ceilings and stuff, I guess. We'll have to learn how to do all that stuff. But, yeah. That's good. You need to be... You, oh, you tend to be. You tend to be impatient at times. I thought they said, I need to be impatient. Oh, look at him. He got this done all today. Oh, very good. Cool. Hey, so that debris done. I do wish, though, in this game, I do wish that you could, like, have, like, the free build. You know? Like, build anywhere you wanted to. It does kind of suck that you can only build on, like, these platforms. You know? It'd be cool if you could, like, free build anywhere up against here, over there, or over there, up against the wall. Right? That'd be fun. This drives me absolutely nuts. Let's talk to some people. Hello, Mo. I think a carpentry workbench would will help us develop the craftsmanship you are looking. Uh, you are so much. Wait, you are you care so much about? Wait a second. The carpentry workbench. We already have that up, right? This is perfect. Yeah. You're also a carpenter. No, you probably had one of this. You probably had one of this at some point, right? You probably had one of this at some point, right? How could you develop your skills otherwise? Kind of. My dad had a garage full of tools set up as a wood shop. We spent a lot of time together. I could hardly reach the shelves at the beginning. My mom was always concerned that I could get hurt, but my dad taught me how to handle tools and be safe. It sounds like proper training to me. I could never see... I could never see it as work, you know? For me, it was a form of playing. While other kids wanted to play sports, I wanted to build furniture. Must have been really popular then. Never cared much about that. So, uh, from... <laughs> yeah, she was real pop... She was the most popular kid at school because she decided not to do sports, but instead, she decided to, uh... build furniture. Uh, from the garage you had, anything that you miss, maybe we can build it here, right? Good point. I guess uh, we don't have a tinkering station. Oh, yeah, yeah. Tinkering station? I'll show you. Build a tinkering station, I guess. Yeah, that's true. I could connect the buildings on the second floor as well. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool, right? Research site level two. Gain knowledge and new techniques and learn how to operate, construct, or build something new. That sounds pretty good. A ceramic station. A kitchen station. A mechanic station. Simple mechanical systems. A simple but very useful kitchen station to marinate and grill any food you like. Generic workbench, the beehive, compost, the tinkering station. What are we missing? A lot of different things. I do like this though. What do we need for that? Oh, what the heck is that? I don't know what that is. Milled wood. Milled wood. I don't think we can do milled wood yet. That's probably something totally different like a... Uh, like a, a lathe, <laughs> a chop saw, maybe. We're going to have so many freaking. Uh, yeah, so many different things. A table saw, a bench grinder, drill press, machine for cutting small pieces of wood. That probably would be it. We would need blades and electric motor. Okay, let's take the electric motor, I guess. Okay, we need blades. Not the blade runner, but blades. There we go. We're gonna need another generator too as well. Here we go. Build that. Do we have a stairs blueprint? We do have a stairs blueprint. We do. Blade or bandsaw, sorry. Right there. 
operate. Columns and 4x4 four four columns. Uh, right, so not exactly what I was thinking, but maybe when we get our research up, possibly. There we go. Preserved foods now. A CAD. Creation of custom blueprints for room-sized objects. Now, does that mean we can just make our own blueprints from that? How does that work? Technical drawing. Creation of... Oh, God. All right. I guess we're tired. We're going to need a bunch of uh, materials for that, too. A bunch of wood. What happens if we run out of wood? How do we go about that? Do we need to start buying wood if we run out of wood? I have no idea. No idea. <laughs> How you doing, Sakura? And Jamie says hi. He loves watching you. It's the only time I can get to him to get him to sit down. Well, hello, Jamie. How you doing? Hey. What's going on? <laughs> oh, my Lord. Look at all that. Look at all the harvest. It's all ready. It's all... Look at... Wow. Can I just, like, run a train here? Yeah, so those those onions... Those onions are, like, all bugged, I think, maybe? Possibly? Corn? I can harvest corn. Okay, I got that done. Don't touch this. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Let me pack up the soil. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, corn. Damn it, I don't have potatoes anymore. Frick. So now I don't have the four crops. Double frick. Okay, right. All right, all right. Very well. We'll sell 36 carrots to Cedric. Weird seeing a single carrot like that. <laughs> I guess we could buy a potato seed. Sir, give me like 10 seeds. Thank you. And I'll sell you... Um, I'll sell you a bunch of carrots. 540. There you go. Hey, Charles. How you doing, Charles? What's going on? When you said, hey, my dog Porthos... Porthos? Is that how you say the name? Porthos? My dog Porthos looked up at the TV. <laughs> he knew better. He knew better. <laughs> so funny. All right, here we go. Let's do this correctly, please. Nobody, you know what? Fine, whatever. Touch this if you're going to touch it. But I should have enough wood to finish this off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You look at you. You're so quick to come over here and put your corn in it. Yep. I know. Yeah, this blueprint is messed up. They need to fix this blueprint because it is ass backwards. Here we are go there we go there we go oh oh do i not have any soil on me i'm gonna be so upset okay no i'm good boom perfect all right we have the alpha planters in and they are there do whatever you want to them your choice your prerogative okay now, um, I think we're going to need a planner now. Yeah. He started talking to you like you could hear him. Oh, very good. <laughs> yeah. I love that. <clears throat> My wife thinks you're Italian. Are you Italian? I am. How did she know? <laughs> How did she know? Is it because I yell? Is it because I use my hands? How in the world did she know? Or was it the name? <laughs> we 
But she is correct. She is, she is. Alright, so we'll make a bunch of this stuff. And hopefully... Put it away. Give it to them. There we go. Do a little bit of this. And obviously this is these are things that, you know, we don't have to do. We can let the um, the people of the community do it, but if you want something done correctly, do it yourself. Basically the boat I'm in. Go. Very close. My accent, really, my accent. That's the first. I will say, my that's the first. I had nobody say that before. But you can definitely tell I'm not from New York, though. I hope you can. I'm not from New York, I promise. They're, they, you know. My main, um, yeah, I'm making planks, basically. I'm making planks so that these, uh, they can go and finish the buildings out there. There we go. Because they need some of this stuff, right? They need all that good stuff. Wait a sec. Did I not make any 4x8? I don't think I need 4x8. I don't need 4x8. Oh, we do have the 7 walls. Let's use the 7 walls. Let's put them up ourselves, I guess. We'll put it up on the other thing. Yeah. I thought you were from the Jersey area when I first heard you until you said you were from Cali. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely not from New Jersey. There we go. Nope, 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 nope. No. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Time out. That's not what I wanted. I wanted this. There we go. Ah, perfect. 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 Good. Okay. And then in between there, right, we'll put the uh, the 4x4 four four columns right up the middle. Right? That does not look right. Pack that in. Is it the 4x4 four four that goes there? It should be. Not the 4x8, no? Maybe I put that in wrong? That doesn't look flushed. But maybe that's the point of it? So that it doesn't look flushed? I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Oh my god. Perfect. Then I don't have enough to do the back here. Have a good one, Anti Meow. Have a good rest of your evening, and thanks for hanging out with us. Do appreciate it. Okay. That looks good so far. I mean, that's progress. If anything, that, that's progress being made out here. They have the items that they need to build. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go research for the rest of the day, and they should get a start on that in the morning. Let's see, let's do. I want to do kind of technical drawing. Yeah, clearing wouldn't be bad. Eagle Eye. I don't even know what the heck Eagle Eye is. Find more resources from debris piles. Maybe I should have done that a long time ago. Um, ecology would be cool, but like, I don't know. I don't think it's like a top priority right now. Let's go technical drawing, I guess. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, 9 p.m. Day 25. Gotta go home. Got, gotta, gotta, gotta go to bed. I try to use as much as I can. I know, like, we have all these different kinds of areas where we can put things and things like that, but I try to use, like, as, like, try to use up my space as, as efficient as possible. Like, there's a part of me that feels like I need to use every little tiny square inch of these platforms that I build on. That's why, like, you see, like, where all my workstation is, it's super crowded. You know, it's, like, super, super crowded. 
over there. Because I feel like I need to use all that space. But I don't necessarily need to. You know? That's just how my brain is working right now, I think. Okay, we just need potatoes in there now. So then they should be jumping on that. That's good. That's fine. We should be jumping on... I don't even know what we should be jumping on. Maybe we should go back to uh, check out... Well, no, Mark is here, right? Maybe Mark isn't here. Maybe Mark is out uh, doing his thing over here. Are you the type to put things on the counter to use the space? Uh, you mean like in real life? Like putting stuff on the kitchen counter? Um... That's a good question, if that's what you mean. I'm trying to think of, like, like scenarios. I mean, I do... <laughs> I do use the kitchen space counter for... Uh, things. Uh, what? <laughs> Hey, Neverly. How you doing, Neverly? Oh, you've been super sick? Oh, don't worry about it. Don't be sorry. Hope you f hope you get better soon, yeah? Hope you get better soon. So there's a part of me that's feeling a, a few things right now. Hang on a sec. Um, there There is a few things that I'm feeling from this a little bit. So... Actually, time out. Before I talk about that, hang on a sec. Let me Let me just check a few things out up here. But there are a few things I'm feeling from this. Like, there's no, like, secret wall back here or anything like that, right? Okay. Um. How much more is there into this game, like, open-wise? Like, okay, so we, we can build here, obviously. We can have Ruby with us. Is Ruby the last person we can potentially get? Those guys left. Those, like, ant farm guys, they left. They're not here anymore. Is Ruby the last person we can get in the colony? Or is there another area that will have more? I'm trying to look at this in a progressive state here. But if you come out here, I, I don't I, I don't know. I, I really don't know. I'm really not sure. Is there somewhere else to go once you get out here? There's nothing out here that tells me yes. Everything in the world tells me this is the last bit of it here. And you basically build everything out here as well. And just kind of rebuild and just rebuild a society out here. Look at that a blueprint that we passed. A bristle? Bristly? Bristly? What the hell is that? Is that a fence? A brisoli? A brisali? Brisali? Br F it. Pronunciations. Remember? But to me, I don't think there's anywhere else that we're going to be able to go in the future. At least that's what I see. The thing that I see is we get Ruby, and then what we do is we then rinse and repeat. Kind of like building a thing here, building a thing here, building a thing there. Maybe there's more to it, but I don't know. I'll be honest with you. I, I do not know. I'm not seeing it anymore. I'm not seeing it. But I could be wrong about that. People come and go and they said earlier. So people come and go. So, okay. People come and go. You get Ruby, right? That's going to be the fifth person. And then people come and go. So let's see here. You would get more people. 10 people, 15 people. And then you go on to build more out there then. Okay. That's probably how it is, right? You just expand uh, your society over time. Just, okay. More people come, more people have different skills. And then you just... Um, you just go outside and start building stuff for them also. Kind of, not relocate them, but you know, something rather. Okay, I, I, I see it. I see it. 
All right. This is going going well. There is going to be things where you automate too. So the automation thing is very key as well. I am interested in the automation. Oh crap, we need a uh, power. There we go. Yeah, there is the automation thing also. Like there's a lot of different things going on here for sure. I guess that's why I'm holding back on expanding so much in so many different locations because maybe there, you know, there's going to be a lot more as far as like people and all that. Um, that's why I'm trying to save as much space. That's why all my things are in this one little plot here, you know, and I want to save all those open, open platforms for building elsewhere. I see that you're still working on that large farm. Let me know if you need any help. Did I not get my potato in? I did not get my potato in very well. We have a lot of corn, though. Let's see if we can, like, take half of that corn, half of the carrots, and sell that. Where do the people come from? Where do they get in? I don't know. Maybe they come at the front gate or something. There's an elevator you can take. Now, elevator, that's all news to me. Here we go. 825. 1500 there you go you're almost got we need three thousand dollars for cedric that's another reason yeah we need three thousand dollars for him we'll do more of this fps trick hey says i'm so excited i catch you live i was always end up missing them but i just wanted to say thank you your live streams really helped me through a day oh very well fps chick how you doing good to see you thank you for coming in and saying hello how are you good to see you how are you if different people turn up and some are willing to join others not so much some with new trades and etc i see okay wonder how many blueprints there are in this game too Cause like this cutscene here, what if you had like 20 people, would they all be in this cutscene? Is there a capacity to people in, in your colony? Cur bear, cur bear, bear, cur bear. <laughs> How's it going bear? Hey bright. How you doing bright? Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Alpha planter. What the hell is that stuff? I feel like they're not being watered. I feel like they're not getting watered at all. I feel like I constantly see these water things not like... Yeah, I feel like the water... Like, I don't know. Are you bugging out over here? Not you. You're not the one doing it. It's Mo that's doing it. So what is this tinkering station? You'll see. So the tinkering station she wants... Or he wants. Uh, Hey, Nikki. Have you found any project I can work on? No, I have not. Mark, anything for you, Mark? Nikki, the composting operation is going well. We have worm farm creating some nice fertile soil for the farms. That sounds great. I wasn't sure uh, we could grow much here. Some of the soil here is slowly recovering, but with this fertile soil, uh, you will be able to grow anything. Oh, before I forget, if you come across any books or manuals on recycling techniques, uh, that could really help me out here. I think we'd have that. I'll let you know if I find anything. I think we have that, right? Hey, Nikki, did you find anything? Nothing yet. This place is huge. We are still figuring out how to reach new areas. No problem. Or sure, problem. I thought we had the book. Steel, plaster, advanced carpentry. No, I guess we didn't have the book. Interesting. There you go. Water it up. Now, look at this. There's like three crops in here. <laughs> you got like a corn, an onion. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> Have a good night, James. Have a good night. How am I doing tonight? I'm doing good. FPS, chick. Yeah, yeah. I'm doing good. Just enjoying some common hood in the hood here. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Let's go up here. Let's see. I'm trying to see if there's like a book anywhere about recycling. Ruby. 
Why don't you be nice to us? I'll keep you warm, Ruby. I promise. Is this a fake wall? That looked like a fake wall, but maybe not. Is it Care Bear or is it Cur Bear? Cur Bear? I know it's not Care Bear because it doesn't, it's not spelled like Care Bear, but maybe you like to be, I don't, I don't know. Cur Bear? Cur Bear? Cur Bear. How about that? Cur Bear? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. False wall? No false wall. Got it. Hey, Carrie. How you doing, Carrie? What's going on, Carrie? Oh, maybe there's something behind here. No? Okay, nothing behind there. Care Bear as in, like, Care Bear? Very good. So, Care Bear? <laughs> you, can you can obviously argue, like, yeah, like, do this faster. One way to do this faster is, like, do it yourself, right? You want something done, do it yourself. They do take a long time to build something, don't they? They haven't even done anything over here, but they've done, like... I feel like the only thing that has been bare... I feel like the only thing that's been done is just this and this. I did the walls. I did that, right? This, this, and this, maybe. Like, he should be building right now. Red. But he's not. Excuse me, my good man. Going to construction. Yeah, it doesn't look like you're going to a construction. But his, his... Look at that. Trust is there. So we have at least more uh, jobs with him. Or at least longer job with him. I guess that's good. Mo. Have no trust there. No trust there. Research. We can do longer here. That's good. There we go. We have to make a tinkering machine. You're good. You're good. You're good. How do we make the tinkering? It's from here, right? Yeah. What do we need for that? We need all these different things. Okay. Let's see. We have these things. Uh, I don't have that. What is that? Raw steel? I don't think I have raw steel. I don't think I have raw steel. I don't. I do have that. Robotics tools. We'll put the robotics tools. I don't know. Wait. Oh, wait. Is that not? That's not what we needed. Sorry. Take that out. Load it up. That's better. We need machine tools. We need electronic tools. We need wire. We need 20 raw steel. Now, I feel like the raw steel comes from a whole nother thing. Right? Comes from maybe... Uh, something over here? Something rather? Hey! FPS chick! Hello? Hey! Thank you for becoming a member. Appreciate it. That was very kind of you. Very generous. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thank you for that. Big ups to you. Big ups to you. And uh, I hope after this stream, you go and check out the members videos and the members live streams that you have access to 100%. I do hope you do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. Very kind of you. Um, right. Uh, it looks like I'm gonna have to buy a couple of things. Now, there's the electronic tools right there. We'll put the uh, robotic tool in there. There's maybe one thing I might need to buy if I want to do the tinkering machine. No, we have everything but the raw steel. Okay, that's one thing. I'm assuming I build a bench grinder. No, that's for polishing metal pieces. That doesn't make sense. Pipe benders for bending pipes. Um, machine workbench, no. Generic, no. 
no and no. I don't know. I don't know how you would get raw steel. It would have to be from one of these machines. Maybe a bench grinder. Maybe it is a bench grinder. Alright, I wasn't sold on it, but I guess it might be. Who knows? I guess we're going to need it eventually anyways. So let's do it. Oh, do I not have metal disc? Oh, I don't have any blades. Metal blades. Or sorry, metal discs. That blades or discs? It said blades. So metal discs. So one would get metal disc by... Shoot, dude. I don't know. By drill pressing? <laughs> no, you need that to get... Okay, but you need the raw steel to get that. Okay, I don't know. I'm really not sure. Maybe it has to do with research. So technical drawing, what does that give us? Honestly, don't know. Maybe something good. Uh, There it is. Metal steel. Crafting ability to cut and handle steel. So that is an entire research. But how would one unlock that, I wonder? Unless somebody teaches us it. Yeah, I think somebody has to teach us it. It might be Rhett that might have to, like, mention about it. But we can't do the tinkering station, right? Yeah, we can't do the tinkering station. Can't do the tinkering station until we uh, get that skill. That's my only thought there. That's all I got. We need potatoes uh, grown, though, ASAP. Because if we run out of carrots and then we got to deal with the potato thing, we got to get that stuff out. I might have to plant that myself. Um. Uh, do I have any soil? I don't think I have any soil. I don't. I was going to build another one, but maybe not. Alright. We'll leave that how it is. Have you already opened that wall? Yeah, I've opened that wall. Yeah. Metal bench for the discs? Is that what it is? Let me see. Metal bench for the discs. If I can make that, then that's something. Metal bench for the discs. There they are. Fantastic. Collect all. Load this up. We need gears. Really grind. You know what really grinds my gears? Go. Load that. Go. This. Good. Load it up. Then I grab it, son of a bitch. I can't remember how much I mean I need. Okay, so that well, what the heck was that one for again? That was for the thing over here. <laughs> it was for the bench grinder. Yeah. Okay. Did I not grab it? Okay. Luckily, all this stuff is right next to each other. So, we need five of those. Okay, five of those. What am I missing then? More gears? I've been on maternity leave since July, and your content has really helped me decompress at the end of the day. Oh, very good. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. That's awesome. Thank you, FPS chick. Is this as close as we get to playing? Uh, is this as close as we get for you playing The Sims? Probably not, no. The closest thing you'll get to me playing The Sims might be... Um, Paralives, whenever that comes out. Paralives or... I've done a video on Housetopia already. 
That's like the closest thing. I mean, the tenants is pretty close too. Okay, bench grinder coming in. Here we go. Okay, there we go. Bench grinder. Hey! Good God! Hey! Ladies and gentlemen, that was like 10 gifted memberships by uh, Kitten. That was very kind and very generous of you. Big ups to you and congratulations to Nick, Charles, uh, Cord, you, Wam, F, me, Arden, <laughs> Deanna, Sakura, Angel Wolf Gaming, Loose, Creepy, and Flip for picking up those memberships on behalf of the 10 people that just picked up a membership. We say thank you very much, Kitten. I watch every single dang, dang of it if you played The Sims. <laughs> Thank you very much. That was very kind. Very kind indeed. OBS is going crazy now. Thank you. So, okay. We have the bench grinder there. I guess we can see what that makes too. Whew. Watch out now. I've been supporting Paralives on Patreon forever. If it could... Uh, if it could please come out already, that'd be great. <laughs> That's a game I'm looking forward to uh, uh, to playing for sure. Absolutely. Yeah. Hit it up with the Willy Wonkas. Willy Wonka face. All right, let's see what this thing does. I don't know what it does, but we'll, we'll figure it out, I guess. I would like to put potatoes down, but, you know, I guess we'll wait. We'll wait. I'll, I'll, I'll do it on my own time here. I'll, I'll, like, I'll go to the side, I'll make a tiny little box, and I'll put a potato in it. The reason why is because we need four different crops in our stockpile to complete one of the quests. So the bench grinder uh, definitely makes this stuff. So blades, metal, or sorry, metal disc, metal rods, nails, gears, metal wheels. Basically make some of the same stuff that we've had before, but it makes like stuff we don't have, like the metal wheels, the metal rods, and things like that. I don't even know if we have nails either, but all right, so that's what that makes. It's good to have, at least we have it, right? Yeah, at least we have it. My lord, what just happened? Hey! Thank you for the re-ups! <laughs> oh my lord. Oh, hang on a sec, guys. I, I gotta say this, thankfully. Uh, was that Amy? Amy came. Amy with the re-up. Debbie Ray, Rachel Robinson, Piper, Obel, Jason, Obel, Jason, um, Irim Irimel, Irimel, Safria, Safira, 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 Sapphira, Adriana, Autumn, Ladora, Danny, Wendy, Sai, Isabeau, Adamality, Rachel, Colin, J Mac, Hera Hill, and David Williams. Thank you all for the re ups. Appreciate that. Thank you all for re upping your membership on the channel here. My God, that's a big list of people we just went through. Thank you all. Today is November 10th. Appreciate it 100%. OBS is going to go ding ding for even more. I apologize. I do apologize. Hey, Pat. How you doing, Pat? Try waiting for Cyberpunk for years and then bam, it comes out and then you get what you get. Am I the only one that's thinking at this rate? Most of the building locations are going to get filled with 1,001 workbenches. I, I kind of, 
that's the thing. Like, I'm. Uh, that's why I have everything over here. Is like, I I don't know, cause like like the look, this little tiny thing, these little tiny things, like all these different little tiny things that want to be added to, uh, or that we can build and make and have, right? I I I'm I'm feeling you on that. I I agree. There's gonna be a lot. Like, I don't even think we have a table saw yet. We don't have a table saw yet. My lord. So like, yeah. Have a good one, Masumi. Have a good rest of your evening. Thanks for hanging out with us. I see pumpkin cheesecake. That sounds amazing. Okay. Um. <laughs> uh, are we? Is it? Is are we good? Are we good? Now we're good. Okay. Thank you, David. One year for David Williams. Shout out to you. Thank you for the one year of support. Right. So. I, I, I don't know. I, I really should really like I really I should really I really I should really I really I should really make this myself and then plant the potato in there myself. I'm going to need some wood though real quick to do it. Pumpkin cheesecake. Ugh. Slap me silly. Would have been a better idea to have had some of those as extra fittings to some of the other benches. Yeah, I think that would have been cool. Like, for instance, if you could have, like, maybe, like, attach this. Like, if there was, like, attachments or something that you can add, like, somewhere. I think that would have been kind of cool, you know? And the one thing that bugs me is, like, everything has a place on a platform except for this. This generic workbench, which is the workbench that they gave you, they gave you. That's the only workbench that's not on the platform. <laughs> okay, so let's do it. Uh, do I have soil? Hang on, I might not even have soil. Do I have soil on me? Let me get soil. And then in here, let me put this in here. There we go. Jasmine, how you doing, Jasmine? Finally caught you live. How you doing, Jasmine? What's going on? I also think repeat recipes are more effective recipes. Repeat recipes are my uh, are more effective recipes. I don't know what you mean by that. Repeat recipes are more effective recipes. Let's see here. Uh give me so do I did I run out of soil? There's no way I ran out of soil. There's no freaking way. I ran out of soil? Oh, well, that's an issue. How did I run out of soil? Do I really not have any soil left? So I can't make any more planter bo uh, planters? Is that like the game trying to limit me? Okay. All right. Well, I don't have any more soil. Interesting enough. So do you get better quality if you make it multiple times? I think there's only like one quality. Oh, they take less resources. Is that what it is? The recipes are better. Take less. Re I'm so confused now. I'm super confused. Did I really run out of soil? That's a bummer. I don't know how I feel about that. I wish there was a way to like get rid of like plants. Like, oh, I don't want this plant to be here. You know, get rid of it. And then this, I don't even know what the hell is going on here. I don't know what. Like, there's like carrots, onions, uh, corn. Yeah, I do wish there was a way to like get rid of plants, though. And this is the thing, like. I don't, I don't know. There's, there's, it's, it's very wildly, wildly, wildly. Tinker machine. But I won't be able to do the tinker machine until I get the research. Now, I want to get the research site level, but I don't, don't know how to make that. I wish there was also a prompt where if, like, you hovered over something and you weren't sure how to make it, like, it would at least tell you, like, oh, you know, this. If you want to get this, you need to unlock X. 
Instead, it's like a giant guessing game. Kitchen station would be kind of cool. Mechanic station. I guess we can technically make a mechanic station, no? What it be used for? I don't know. Mechanic stuff? Right? Probably. What about the compost? Ah! Good shout. Let's go to the compost. We even clicked on the compost. Yeah, let's click on the compost. Good shout. That's, that's good stuff. Good stuff right there. So what do I need for that? What the frick do I need for fertile soil? I need soil to make soil. Okay. Mulch. Okay, compost. No, you can't make fertile soil without soil. How do I get soil? If you run out of soil, how do you get soil? Is the game suggesting me that I destroy and get rid of my other planter boxes? Or do I dig through this? Which would take me another five minutes at least. <laughs> so like, okay. For a few items that dropped here, what are these few items? Okay, raw panel. Just that. That was the only thing that dropped. But to make soil, you have to have soil. Compost takes the organic waste. Which enrich your soil. Okay, so to make you okay, so basically how it works is wait a sec. Mulch. A layer material applied to the soil for the conversation uh not the conversation, but the conserv conservation conservation of moisture and to improve fertility. You put that on top of your, on your fertile soil? Because for the fertile soil, you need compost and you need soil. Okay, that, that's a little strange. So I guess when you run out of soil, you run out of soil. Unless you buy soil from Cedric. Maybe Cedric sells soil? Cedric does not sell soil. Maybe he will when you upgrade his market. Which, by the way, I should probably do that. Uh, yeah. You're only, like, less than $400 off. Let's see if we can sell him some food. Let's see if we can upgrade him real quick. Oh, he has a food storage right next to him. I'm an idiot. Just use the food storage right next to him. Instead of running all the way back. Right there. Right behind him. Let's go... Corn... And that's it. That should be that should be enough, right? Cedric? Corn? There you go. 833. That's good. Okay, so now we should be able to do the farmer's market, right? If you help me expand my stand at the farmer's market, I might be able to offer you more produce. What do you say, kiddo? Uh, yes. Contract. So we got to go all the way back to... Um, what's his face for the to complete the contract? Got it. Yeah, I was hoping that, like, some of these places would... Or, what are these called? They're called, uh... Because we got soil from this last time. Stockpile. I was hoping they would, like, come back with more stuff, but... Doesn't seem that's the case. Let's see. Contract, yeah. Let's help out Cedric. Contract. Farmer's market. Give him it all. And that will do the market stand, or the farmer market stand. Load all, load all. Can't even load all. F me, dude. Complete it. Okay, so the farmer's market is completed. Flea market. Okay, no, not you, actually. Go talk to Cedric. Oh, we're not going to be able to talk to Cedric because it's going to be too late because it's almost 9 p.m. unless I get there in less than 30 seconds. Oh, my lord. Whew. Worm bin. Okay, maybe the worm bin makes the soil. Good shout. Thanks for helping me expand the farmer's market stand. I have a lot of new things to offer now. What does he got? Uh, we can always go a bit bigger, you know. Uh, if you help me keep uh, expanding our presence in the farmer's market, I'm sure I'll be able to bring more unique products. What do you say? 
Very well. Too tired to talk to Cedric and see his new uh, new comings. Right. How odd you can't load all? I know, right? Like, what is the load all f button there in the first place? I don't know. What I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly go over to Cedric first. I'm going to see. Cedric, buddy, we expanded your farmer market, Stan. How are we looking? What does that look like to us, right? What does that look like? Fish. Okay. Fish, flour, eggs, hops, malt, military rations, salt, tomato seeds, and cabbage seeds. So new things. That's cool to see. I'm very interested to see. I don't know. I, no, there, there wouldn't be. I was going to say, I don't know if there's going to be animals in this game, but I, I, I highly doubt it. Very, very much highly doubt it. But that's good. Yeah. That's good. Awesome. All right. Well, we, at least we know where we're at here. This this is ridiculous, though. I, I like how long this is taking. I should have just did it myself. Honestly. Like, I can't believe he's been sitting here doing this for like three, four days now. And it's not like he was missing items because the son of, son of a gun had items for so long. Now he doesn't. But, but the son of a gun had items for so long. I don't know what the hell he's been doing this entire time. But, you know, that is what it is. Hey, Chibi, how are you? Let's go ahead and save it. We'll save it. All right, so we'll save it. And what we will do is we will stop it there for today. Yes, 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 I know. F me. Oh, God. <laughs> Saker 91 became a member. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, hang on a sec. Let me try to find a way to... Quiet, Angel this man. Wolf Gaming became a member. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh my god. Creepy Law became a member. I think I did it. Okay, there. Uh, yeah. Anyways, it's been a pleasure and honor to be with you today. Hope you all enjoyed um, seeing Common Hood. The first five hours of Common Hood we uh, dove into here. Uh, this game is currently what is it? Twenty four ninety nine USD on sale right now for ten percent off. If you're interested in this game, uh, pick it up yourself now or add it to your wish list maybe wait for a discount or something this is officially the 1.0 launch this is not early access or anything so this is 1.0 if you're thinking oh maybe this is early access we'll see a roadmap no 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 this this is this is this is launch so if i were to rate it and give you a complete honest thing here i would probably say I, there's enjoyment is there enjoyment in this game yes there's enjoyment with this game okay there's enjoyment I think you can get really creative in this game, especially with the sandbox mode. Now, multiplayer, you could probably even have 10 times even more fun. There is multiplayer in this game too. So, multiplayer in this game would be kind of interesting, right? I, I, I agree. If I'm giving you my complete honesty though, would I pay, and by the way, I did not, I did not buy this game. I did get a key from the developers. So thank you guys, or thank you publishers. Appreciate that, but with that being said, would I buy this game for $25? I don't think I would. Would I buy this game if it was on sale? Yes. Wait for a sale, I think. This is a wait for a sale kind of game. If you're remotely interested, wait for a sale. Simply. Simply. That's it. That, that that that's that's what i would put i think it's enjoyable um there is still bugs in this game it's still kind of clunky I, I i feel like some aspects of it is clunky uh multiplayer i think would be a hoot honestly i think there will be more updates to this game to fix out things so i think you know the developers will see where it's at and i think they will uh iron some things out but i think it's a i think it's a wish list wait for a sale kind of game which by the way Black Friday, right around the corner, and they do the big sale on Steam for Black Friday anyway, so this game might be on sale in the next week or two. You never know, right? Yeah. 
So, hope you all enjoyed. If you guys want to see more of Common Hood, you got to let me know. Hit the like button right now. That tells me. If you're watching this in the replay, go down in the replay. Uh, comment down below and say, yeah, I would like to see more Common Hood. And we'll see if uh, if it gets enough likes and if, see if, any, if most of y'all enjoy it and I'll bring it back. But tomorrow, we're going to be looking into a 1.0 release of... What is it? A 1.0 release of... Honey, I Joined a Cult, which is going to be fun. If you've never seen Honey, I Joined the Cult, definitely check out tomorrow's stream because it's going to be kind of fun. I will be creating a cult with chat in the beginning of tomorrow's stream. So you all are going to be uh, giving in your input and all that. And um, there will be cult members that I probably will name after people in the chat. So it's going to be an interactive one tomorrow. Just know that. Uh, so look forward to Honey, I Joined a cult for 1.0 yeah <laughs> thank you very thank you so much everyone uh for hanging out with me me today i want to say a special thank you to christy dm for the gifted membership darren for the super chat and kitten for the freaking bomb of the 10 gifted memberships thank you all so much for the support and uh helping me out i do appreciate it and i hope to see you all tomorrow in honey i joined a cult till then Make sure to take care of yourself tonight, tomorrow, every day from here on out. All right? I'll see you all very soon. Do take care.